Oh yeah, we should be live, I think. Let me check everything. <laughs> Got Ari Nemesis all loaded up. Oh man, bloody shake, I've never been live. I've never been live on my channel. Let me just open it on the tubes. Just open it on YouTube, there we go. Public, cool. Uh, we should be on, I think. Uh, let me open this. I need to see if you guys can chat and all that lot. Open it on my YouTube. Excuse me, I'm a proper noob at this. <laughs> I'm an absolute noob. Cool. Oh, I think I've got it sorted anyway. <laughs> Sweet. If, if you're tuning in, just drop me a message. Let me know. Let me know if it's even working in the first place. Let me just get a link to this up. So I know. can have a look. Let me know if it's... Cool. I think we are looking good. Oh man, it's just been like a mad rush getting ready. I've got my Fred Perry on. Because <laughs> it is my first ever live stream on the channel. Usually, obviously, I'll, I'll have like some like more chill gear on and uh, resi stuff. I've not really got any resi 3 themed stuff yet, unfortunately. Not really got any resi 3 merch. I do have an RPD hoodie, um, yeah, for like resi 2. I suppose I could have it on for this anyway. I probably will do. Like, just give me like an hour or something. I'll be complaining um, that I'm cold. So, yeah, I'm just starting off on some nice H2O at the moment. And then I do have some G Fuel for after. So, um, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll uh, break into that soon. It's basically like an alternative, like, um, you know, just like to your regular energy drinks, basically. It's like one of them, like, uh, powders that you add to water. And obviously it contains, like, um, artificial sweeteners, no sugar, but it's got, like, the sweeteners to, obviously to make it nice and sweet and everything. Um, so, yeah, I'm celebrating tonight with Nemesis tea flavour. So it is actually, like, a bit of a lemon tea flavour. But, um, yeah, it's like... A, I wouldn't say it's like so much a tea though, because it's very sweet. Like it doesn't have the bitter taste, um, like tea. So just give me a second. I'm just gonna post on the socials. <laughs> I'm just literally gonna post a picture on there. Pop it on my Insta story. Just say we are live. Um, yeah. As I say, sorry, it's been a bit of a mad rush because I've had to do like a bit of a test stream, make sure everything's all good. Um, so yeah, I just wanna. Uh, make sure everything's live now. Uh, Holster TV. What do I even write? I'm not used to streaming at all. Holster TV. That's all good. I'm such a noob. I shall start the game in just a moment because I think I've got some viewers anyway. <laughs> Probably got like two viewers. That's it. I'll just stick that on the social. It'll be fine. It's a bit of a rushy one but it's fine you know me guys i'm sure if you've been subscribed to the channel for a while i'm always fashionably late all the time ad says hi hi mate thank you for tuning in i appreciate it so yeah there we go that's that on the insta phones on do not disturb so it's not gonna be pinging off all the time just pop it on insta because i've got quite a lot of people on insta well you know subscribers and stuff people do head over to my insta so yeah i can see the top chat uh, if anyone subscribes i do have a little thing I have a little kendo thing and it comes up going i'm sorry about that um kendo should come up anyway i hope so um <laughs> here's luke is my cousin with one of our classic faulty towers quotes is this a piece of your brain <laughs> i feel like i've got no brain at the minute man um i feel like an absolute noob uh, with this um so yeah uh don't know how many we've got a few viewers in at the moment so yeah um I've done a test stream, so it all should be good. Just let me know. I'm going to boot up the game um, in just a sec. And uh, let me know if like the audio and game levels are all good. Um, so say, I'm starting off on some water. I'm going on some G Fuel. The G Fuel's awesome. Right, what's this going to play? It's going to play some Play-Doh. Let's just get rid of this. <coughs> There we go. Let's watch this classic intro. Let's get all hyped for this. Fred Perry's on. Nemi's on screen. Let's go. 
Right, so let's jump into it. This is the original Resident Evil 3. So this is the classic Rebirth mod. Um, so we've got original mode. For now, we're just going on light mode. You kind of get a bit spoiled, a bit pampered, but I deserve the pampering because I'm the Resi Queen. I like to think so. <laughs> nah, um, so yeah, just for now, it's just because um, it's like my first, um, you know, like live stream stuff so I can chat along with you guys. So yeah, I just want to like have a really nice chilled run through of Resi 3. So we've got on light mode. Um, it's got loads of costumes. I haven't determined which one is which yet. So we'll just go normal for now, just because we're, we're doing like a normal playthrough. Uh, but obviously, this is the classic Rebirth mod. So it's basically the same game, but just the uh, graphics are just slightly more polished. That's all. It's not absolutely HD, but um, graphics are more polished up. So we'll go with the normal. Um, we shall jump into it. So this is just telling us uh, all beginner stuff. We know this. We know this from back in the day. It all began as an ordinary day in September. An ordinary day in Raccoon City. A city controlled by Umbrella. No one dared to oppose them. And that lack of strength would ultimately lead to their destruction. I suppose they had to suffer the consequences of their actions. But there would be no forgiveness. If only they had had the courage to fight. It's true that once the wheels of justice begin to turn, nothing can stop them. Nothing. It was Raccoon City's last chance, and my last chance. My last escape. Hell yeah, everyone loves a bit of September 28th. This is Chopper Delta, preparing to drop off at area E95070. Iconic cutscenes. What are they? They all are, anyway. All incredible. Is that Ed Sheeran? <laughs> that got a couple of like Ed Sheeran that one. <laughs> Pray out there in Raccoon City. Yeah, last escape and a rude escape of <laughs> that. Kind of an exit is that out of your apartment? Let me just pause it for two seconds. I just need to check that I'm actually um, streaming up to YouTube in HD. That's fine. That's fine. I just wanted to check that. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, when I was trying to get all my streams figured out, I have done the contract. Yeah, that's cool. Should be fine. If you look onto the right one. There we go. Um, but, yeah, when I was trying to, like, figure out my streams and everything, I'll tell you in a sec, this bit's iconic. Legit, when I was younger, I thought, they're going to grab hold of me. Look how close they are. So close already at this part. September 28th, daylight. The monsters have overtaken the city. Somehow, I'm still alive. Yeah, I'll tell you in just a sec. Um, I don't like to interrupt the cutscenes because they're all just so iconic. We need to appreciate their brilliance. Okay, we've got to get out of here. What? What do you think you're talking about? I just lost my daughter out there. How dare you tell me to go back outside? I'm 
sorry about your daughter, but there isn't gonna be any rescue. We have to get out of here. No! I'm not going anywhere. I'd rather starve to death in here than be eaten by one of those undead monsters! Now leave me alone! What is it? I think it's called Dario, isn't he? He's always been a mildly sod. Do you remember him, Luke? My cousin's in the chat. We used to play these as a kid. Do you remember just going up to the door? I said, Maybe. leave me alone! I'm not leaving! <laughs> Never! Alright, Wolf of Wall Street. I'm not leaving! <laughs> Um, yeah, ads. Th this is not the remake. Um, I'm playing through like the originals first. Um, I will jump into the remake. I completed it the other day. There we are. Already spoiled, look. Because good old holster picked the light mode. Um, but yeah, um, I do plan to stream the remake, uh, the remakes anyway of uh, RE One, Two, and Three. Um, but yeah, like I said, this is a, a slight mod. It's the rebirth mod. As you can see, it's just a bit more polished up. Uh, a PC version. There is one called the Seamless HD Project, um, but you actually need the original um, like GameCube file of the game to run that, which I'm trying to obtain. I I've kind of got the physical copy, but it's actually getting it onto here. Um, yeah, and that mod, the Seamless HD, that is really, really nice and crisp, and I, I really would love to stream that. Um, but yeah, you have to... Uh, this kind of points so we're going to be like really spoiled throughout the game anyway. Um, yeah, so I'm going to have to, like say, just sort out a uh, GameCube um, ISO for that. Um, these, these are all the instructions, uh, you know, obviously. Let's get rid of Use the controls. Um, I'll have to change all the controls around. Um, but yeah, I'm dying to work out how to transfer my uh, GameCube uh, game of, of this and Resi 2 so I can do the seamless HD project. Um, so I may take, I'll take the handgun with us. Uh, we, we've got more than enough bullets. Um, I'll keep them there. Um, I'll take an AR bullets with us. Um, I'll pop these here. Uh, mine, actually, I don't know where to take first thing because we're, we're literally just going to be like showered in it. I think we'll be fine. Uh, I don't, I don't like to overdo it because I already feel like I'm kind of cheating going on light mode. Uh, so yeah, we've got the Magnum shotgun. We're just spoiled with it already. Um, so yeah, we'll see how we go with that. Uh, so yeah, um, Luke said, I'm a couple of hours into RE7, not a hero DLC. Loving playing as Chris so far, man. You know what? I don't think I've actually made it onto the DLC. I actually haven't. I'm sure I installed it and I never got around to playing it. Um, I will definitely go back to that. I need to go back to RE7. Uh, the reason I've not done many playthroughs, well, replaythroughs of it, I've already completed it once. I did it on this channel a few years ago. Don't watch it though, because it's shite. <laughs> um, the the uh, quality in it has gone. I've had to wait till now until I've actually got a decent setup, um, you know, a decent internet to finally be able to stream. Um, and, you know, be able to stream and record in decent quality. Uh, finally invested in a green screen as well. Um, so hence why you can see me on my chair. Because, uh, yeah, I just wasn't a fan of um, just having it all, you know, having a bit of a block in the corner. I mean, it's nothing wrong with it. But I just really love the look of just my outline and the uh, the chair. Because um, that's what I saw on the... I've, I've seen it on like some of my favourite channels. I just think it worked really well. Yeah, it knocks them down easy. I believe that's locked. I think we need to go through here. Uh, Sergi Anarchy. Hello everyone from Russia. I'm a fan of the classic parts of the Resident Evil. Pardon me, I'm good. Resi 2, my love. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, RE2, the original. That's my favourite game. Not even just RE game, video game of all time. I think it's absolutely incredible. It is the perfect sequel. Um, and to think, it almost actually wasn't um, what it was. Because obviously, I don't know if you guys have heard of Resident Evil 1.5. That's obviously what it was going to be. And yeah, no way near as good. When I was testing this game out uh, the other day, I totally forgot about that zombie down there. Um, we'll take this with us just so we can like blast through some if we come across some crowds anyway. Uh, I that. My OCD, man! The diagonal! Damn it, I like them like right next to them. I'm quite OCD with my uh, inventory, as you'll... Uh, to discover. Uh, Derek Walker says hi y'all. Hi Derek. Thanks for tuning in man. I appreciate it. 
<laughs> Luke was Ape's Wi-Fi, not the greatest. Yeah, uh, for those of you who don't know, I was uh, doing an M&M. I was doing a bunny rabbit. I used to live with my mum uh, <laughs> up until about six months ago. I've uh, been in my own place about six months now. It's flown by. Um, yeah, and it wasn't the greatest. The, the problem Ooh. is... The problem is, it's like, uh, she was with Sky. I mean, I'm with Sky anyway. Uh, Sky Broadband. Um, I believe, is it locked on this side? Yeah. Um, but yeah, what it, what it was, Sky are not, obviously, they're not the best for internet. Um, obviously, it's all about your virgin media and all that lot, but still. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, the thing is, I've got Sky here again, though, because I like Sky TV, so I kind of got it all in one package. But my internet actually isn't too bad, because uh, obviously I'm able to stream like this. Um, all being well, fingers crossed, I think it should be fine for you guys. If you notice any, you know, dips in the quality, I will not know what to do about it, because <laughs> this is, like, the best I can get it. Um, this is the best I can get the quality. Um you know what I never knew is literally until like last year when I was watching some playthroughs you actually use the crank for this I've always neglected that part and I never knew that you could actually use the crank for it I had no idea um, I might maybe save some of these for when they're in for when we're in the RPD um, just go to the handgun for now uh, Falcon Scott even Holly how are you good to see a stream for you yeah thanks man you've been uh, watching the channel for ages I'll chat to you in just a second let's just watch Brad get bitten <laughs> Let's just not help him out, right? You actually don't need to. Let's get everything else. Clock tower postcard. The iconic clock tower. We, we can't just like relax and look at this because we've got all the tense music in the background. Picture postcard on the clock tower. The following explanation is printed on the backside. A landmark spot, St. Michael clock tower. Hell yeah. I think we've got some bullets around here. Oh, I've had to do another thing. I should have really took them. <laughs> just don't even help at all. We just got bit about a hundred times then. Bro, free bread. Brad, hang in here. here. Why isn't someone doing something about this? I didn't know you were still alive, Jill. The police aren't trained for this kind of situation. What could they do? Listen, he's coming for us. We're both gonna die. How optimistic, you Brad. You'll see. He's just after stars piss off and leaves There's us. No escape. So he just pisses off and leaves us. Two minutes into the game, we're all gonna die. I don't think Capcom would have allowed that to have like a ten minute game. I don't think they'd have uh, gone away with that. There we go. So combine the fuel to an half lighter. I always wanted to see what um pinball machines these are. Just says an old pinball machine. Uh, but yeah, I call it Brill Creek Brad. He's, he's hit, like, it looks solid. And I always say, we need our hopes as strong as Brad's hair. Hashtag Brill Creek Brad. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, Falcon Scott, how's it going, man? I know you're from London, aren't you? Um, yeah, you've watched your channel for some time, haven't you? I appreciate you tuning in. I know you said, uh, you commented earlier saying uh, that you was uh, excited for the stream. So yeah, thanks for stopping by. Um, Sergio Anarchy. Miss, are you from England? Yeah, yeah, I'm from England. Um, right, so we go in. I think it's up here. Yeah, I'm actually not like the best on Resi 3. Um, Resi 2 is like my absolute know it like the back of my hand sort of thing. But yeah, I'm not the absolute best on this, but I'm, I'm fairly alright. Right, let's see if we can focus in on the barrel because it doesn't always. No, there we go. We got a pretty decent result out of that. We'll use these up. Like I said, we've kind of got showered in all the goodies um, in this light mode, but we just need a, a nice chill stream for tonight. Here's my first stream ever of the channel. It's cray cray. Absolutely cray cray. Photo A, the policemen are pressing forward. They're kind of not the way. That looks rather posy, doesn't it? For the picture. <laughs> Hope this game comes out for the Switch. That would be awesome, wouldn't it? How good would that be? 
Yeah, I think we're best doing the shotgun. Can you not? Can you not? I heard you. I heard you. That was a right weird noise from the shotgun just then. Right, I think we've got a save here. Uh, we'll, we'll just chuck a couple of things in here. Um, but yeah, it, it would be amazing. Because uh, not everyone has the means to play these original games. Ari 1, 2, 3 originals. Um, obviously, they brought Resi 4 out for the Switch, which is awesome. Brought Resi 4 out for the Oculus Rift, which is amazing. Um, yeah. Um, no, sorry. Oculus Quest 2. That's what I'm on about. Um, yeah, I, I really want one so bad. My birthday's in June, so... Uh, <laughs> might try to save up a little bit of birthday money and then add... Which is like the majority of my own money towards sort of thing. I think I'll do that. Um, but yeah, it's just like um, not everyone can play these games. Uh, not everyone can like the the prices of like retro gaming has gone up. Like especially like since the lockdowns and stuff. All right, it's RPD time. Uh, not everyone can afford to to play the actual physical copies. So it's decent even if they come out on the store. I mean, I'm a collector, I like physical copies, but it'd be good digitally to everyone. There we go. Now we don't fuck around. We ain't fighting them, eh? We don't have the means, but we kind of do for sat in the box. But we don't get anything for it on the uh, easy mode, which I've gone for, the light mode. So we're going to enter the police station and gracefully run off. It is funny, though. She's just, she always reminds me of the Michael Jackson meme, you know, with the popcorn. It's like, uh, bread, and she just stood there. <laughs> yeah, we know you're still there, Nemi. Just said, I'm still there. So, yeah, unlike RE2, that bit is boarded up. Um, showered in green hair. We've still got another one on us. Um, yeah, let's have a look. <laughs> Sir Giannaki, the accent is cool. <laughs> Thanks, man. I, I don't really like my accent, but I, I suppose we probably stick out like a sore thumb um, to people in other countries. This bit's a bit blocky. <clears throat> right, so we need the stars card. We don't need the police station map. <clears throat> we the OGs. Um... So yeah, uh, yeah, Falcon Scott definitely. The, the dogs are, are mega annoying. <laughs> uh, I hate zombie dogs. I love dogs in real life. Hate zombie dogs. I always take damage from them all the time. So this is on Resi 2 where we would usually find Marvin. But he's gone. Well, he's not down here anyway, next to the lockers. Yeah, no shit, it's a mess. Can we look? Like here. Oh no. I can't get the camera angle to see the. What was this set before? Um, I was looking for the uh, whole Welcome Leon thing. Because they had like a little like banner up there. Um, for Leon's uh, arrival. Because we've got the means, I'd just like to, uh, to clear out the room. Uh, I don't know if. There's Marvin. So he looks like he's playing dead because there's no actual blood around, there's only the shadow. Shady Marvin. Uh, yeah, RPD officer Marvin Brenner. He's been fatally wounded by zombies. He appears to be holding something in his hand. Okay. So I do read these out just for people who don't know the story or whatever. It's just nice to piece things together. Uh, that You know, they, they do make sense. They're not boring. So Marvin's report. September 24th, so four days earlier. There are reports of a theft in the municipal building before dawn. A jewel decorated clock at the main gate was damaged. Two of the 12 gems that are installed on the face of the clock are missing. So that's just outside the park. So they're the two gems that we go find. Due to the lack of available officers at the time, I have no choice but to suspend the research of this case. They didn't have time. Um, so yeah, on the 26th, based upon an autopsy report of a 42-year-old restaurant owner, I've discovered he has one of the missing gems. He nicked one of them. He apparently took shelter in the police department at about 10am where he was shot to death within 10 minutes of having developed the symptoms. Since the city is currently under martial law, we are forced to suspend this case. At this time, we'll keep the gem as evidence. Signed, Marvin Branagh. 
So yeah, nothing we can do there. Um, he looks just like he did on RE2 as well with the whole... He has like a, a trail of blood down his face. You can see it on there. Uh, so who we got? Um, Pet Mate RE4 Remake. Yeah, that'd be awesome, man. Um, yeah, you'll love the RE3 Remake, Luke. I'm sure you will. Um, it's not as strong as the RE2 Remake. Um, and I feel it, it's just a bit short um, as a game. Uh, it needed more in it. However... Um, so obviously this is one of the gems uh, from Marvin's report we found in here um, for that clock. Um, but yeah, I think you'll enjoy it. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head what this is because there's literally, there's like three or four different options. But however, um, when we get the styles card, uh, we put that into the computer and it tells you the password for today. So yeah, we'll, we'll do it all the legit way and, uh, and do that. Oh, enjoy the stream, Babsy. Go to put the United game now on. Zoom! <laughs> yeah, good luck, man. Hope you enjoy the game. Uh, but yeah, thanks for stopping by, Luke. I appreciate it, man. Thanks for stopping by. I think that's dead, dead, yeah. Got some blood from the feet zombie. Uh, but yeah, uh, thanks for stopping by, Luke. I appreciate it, man. Nice to chat to you for a bit. Um, but yeah, Resi Code Veronica, that's, a, that's another good one. Not everyone's played it either. Oh, shit. Ran into that one. <laughs> kind of needless... Um, needless damage but I can't remember where they all are sometimes they, they do catch me off guard sometimes um, so what we got um, Jeremy Kyle good evening Holly good evening Jeremy <laughs> how I miss your afternoon TV show <laughs> uh, guys Guys, in the UK, we didn't know how good we had it when the Jeremy Kyle show was on. Uh, <laughs> have I grabbed a PS5 yet? Bane85. I have, man. I got it one back in, like, um, uh, like November. I'll pop that back for now, I reckon. Um, what we'll do, we'll pop that back. We'll just take the 7 one because it's, like, fully loaded. Just let me sort this out a second because it does my head in. Let me sort out my inventory, that's it. Don't think we need the lighter. There is a lighter room. There's a room that you use it in on. Actually, we might keep that with us because we. Uh... Actually, we'll, we'll leave it. I don't want to kind of overstock a bit. Um, I totally forgot what I was saying, because I'm saying like a million things at once. <laughs> anyway, let me just read out David's memo. Uh, my sanity is at its end. I still can't believe this is happening. We lost another man yesterday, Mayo, one of our better marksmen. He saw me panic once we were overrun by the zombies, but he came back to save me. But when the time came to return the debt, I ran. I can still hear him calling out my name. I can still hear the screams coming from behind. The sound of his flesh being stripped from its bones. I was afraid, terrified. Um... First I was afraid, I was petrified. It's the 27th. The fight to stay alive continues. I took out several zombies who managed to break through the barricades. Now I'm cutting through the chill with whiskey. I hope that's Jack Daniels. I love a bit of Jade Inco. Unloading my Mossberg on anything undead. That shotgun's become a close friend of mine. I've blasted many a zombie into fertilizer with it. We've lost 13 men as of yesterday. In three hours, we'll bicker over trivial things in the meeting room. It's a total waste of time. When I finish this bottle, my old friend Moss Bear will be turning one last body into fertilizer. Peace at last. I can hardly wait. Oh, damn. So, yeah, he enjoyed his JD. He did it right, at least. That's what I'd do. I'd enjoy the JD. Enjoy your JD and Coke first before you start blasting. Anyway, um... So, ever tried out fish and chips? I actually had chippy tea tonight. Um, we ain't gonna save yet, we're fine. Um, yeah, I actually had chippy tea. I didn't want anything too filling though, so I had sausage and chips. Um, yeah, sausage, chips, and scraps. You gotta make sure, always get scraps, man, it's, it's nice. And always make sure that you get them to put salt and vinegar on at the chippy, because it's just not the same if you do that at home. I wanna break through the G Fuel in a sec. Um, but yeah, you've got to have. Oh, there's a feet zombie. No thanks. Um, there's a few of them. Let's see if we can get a double headshot. 
Let's have a look. There we go. Beautiful. Let's go for the hat trick. Beautiful. <laughs> you gotta have a bit of fun. When we've got the means. We've got the means to do it. Um, but yeah, what do you usually get from the chippy? Are you, are you a fan of the chippy? Uh, so yeah, this is another difference from RE2. Uh, we don't have to do the, the puzzle here. Um, so yeah, I'm all fueled up. Uh, the only thing I need is just, just my drinks. Keep me hydrated throughout the stream. Oh, you need the stars key to unlock it. All right, all right. Is this... Oh, it's boarded up. Damn. I forget, you see. I forget the differences in Resi. Uh, Resi 3. Anyway. Uh, yeah, Paul Craig says, Hey, hey, Paul. How's it going, man? Thanks for tuning in. Um, Jeremy Cal, any more car boot videos coming soon? I do plan on getting some car boot footage. Um, the, my car boot's been closed. Well, closed, yeah. Like, shut for the season uh, for, like, probably the past, like, six months or something, like, ish or something. Um... But they start up back in March, so I, I do plan on getting some more footage because obviously I want to go back game hunting and everything. The problem is I've hardly been able to gather any footage because I'm not coming across as many games. Um, so yeah, that's the problem. It's really gutting and uh, the thing is that everyone else is looking for games. You just cannot choose a more competitive hobby, honestly. Right, I ain't messing around any longer. We get the AR out. See, that's another reason why um, I went on the light mode because I love the assault rifle in this. So it's like on the, on the remake, I love when you play as Carlos and he carries an assault rifle. Um, yeah, it's, it's cool to see you guys all uh, interacting and talking in the chat and stuff. Um, so much love for Resi, the old ones and the remake. Oh, sweet. You had some uh, chippy on, on your lunch break, uh, Scott. That's sweet. Yeah, it can't be chippy. <laughs> Bone 85, got to be a large kebab, mint and mayo. <laughs> oh, I've never had mayo on a kebab. I like... I can go with mint. I like mint. I reckon that'd be good. Um, but I like... Um, I like garlic sauce. You've got to have loads of garlic sauce and a dollar kebab. Uh, Jeremy Kyle again. <laughs> Have you uh, played Resident Evil 2 Remake yet? Yeah, yeah, I absolutely love the RE2 Remake. Uh, for me, nothing will ever beat the original um, Resident Evil 2. Uh, right, Stars card. We need to go back. We need to go back. Uh, yeah, nothing will beat the original. But I do love the remake. Um, there are some stuff which, like I say, it's, it's not perfect, so I, I wish it, you know they have tweaked some parts but yeah it's, it's so difficult to um to like say perfect um a remake of the second one you know what i was really hoping for i was hoping for if any of you guys have played the resident evil one remake um there we go move to the evidence room password for the save is four three one two for the save Oh, that's where Marvin is, isn't it? Oh no, it's the evidence room. Four, three, one, two. Stop, stop overcomplicating it. All. Um, oh, so I forgot. I was on my... Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. Um, Resident Evil Two remake in the style of the first remake. Yeah, it's not in here, is it? Yeah. That's what I was hoping for. Like, I'm very old school. I love the fixed camera angles, the tank controls. That's what I love. Uh, yeah, unfortunately though. Um, well, I say unfortunately, I've got used to it. So, 4, 3, 1, 2. Oh my god, you know what's daunting? The clock tower puzzle. Oh, it's dawning on me. I've just thought about it. I thought we just thought about the clock tower puzzle, man. I've got that to come later. Um... But yeah, he still works well. Still works well in the third person over the shoulder. They've still done good with it. Uh, as with RE3 as well. Um, super shots, how's it going? Yeah, I'm good, thanks, man. Are you alright? Um, yeah, I hope you're well. Um, I don't think we need this card anymore. I'm keeping that because no doubt Nem is going to swipe us. I just know he is. Let me just, uh, what I'm going to do, combine them. Pop the shells back. The the problem is, it's just like, like you say, it's just uh, 
we just get pretty, as it sounds, Skyrim over encumbered on these. <laughs> you get very spoiled because we're on light mode, but we'll keep it that. I'll be fine, we'll be using the key anyway. Uh, Jeremy Carl, have a good evening, Holly. I'm off. Cheers for tuning in, man. I appreciate it. Thanks for uh, coming by. And uh, please come back to daytime TV, Jeremy Kyle. <laughs> like I said, people of the UK, you we don't know how good we had it. Let me just make sure the top's on so it don't go all over my brand new setup. So this is G Fuel. Um, I've got the Ari Village container. Oh, there we go. You can actually see it and it's not all inverted or anything. So nice. So good. Um, so yeah, G Fuel, it's like... Uh, got nemesis tea flavor so people say it's like lemon tea but i don't think not quite i'm mean, not really a lemon tea drinker maybe slightly but it doesn't have a bitter taste to it it's very sweet um so that's how it is it's a style of an energy drink but with no sugar artificial sweetness but by the way i'm absolutely no, in no way sponsored by g fuel i'm just letting you know what i'm drinking um, i discovered g fuel through one of my favorite channels which is residents of evil they're an absolutely incredible uh yeah. Resident Evil channel, um, so they play uh, yeah lots of Resident Evil, uh, retro and modern. Um, picture of the Stars team members. I've I've really wanted this. I've I've wanted a, a picture of this framed, a really nice high quality, and I want it on my coffee table in my living room. So uh, yeah, that is that is the goal. It's a desk of Wesker, Captain of Stars. Um, yeah, it's on RE2. If you click on this like 50 times, it says like um, it's a mess or something. Someone must, someone must have trashed the desk. Do that 50 times, then you get um, you get a photo. There's yeah. too many bullets there. We've got loads. Um, yeah, you get a photo of Rebecca in her, uh, I think it's netball outfit. Um, we, we already have a Magnum. Uh, I know, I know that's a bit kind of daft declining, but we we already have one. It's fine. Um, like I said, we're, we're too spoiled, guys. I can't accept everything. I can't accept everything the game gives us because we're just over... You know what I mean? Um, speak just a sec. I like to keep quiet on the... Uh... No! Come to anyone! Our platoon is cut off! No survivors found! This is Carlo! Immediately. Um, what am I going to say? What am I going to say? Yeah, so Super Shots, playing the remake of Resi 3 at the minute on a hardcore mode. Man, you are brave, seriously. I played it um, just on standard mode because um, Nemi absolutely irritates the hell out of me on the remake. He really does. Um, I played it the other day with my uncle. I, uh, oh, there we go. Sp speak of the doll. He heard us. His ears were burning. Um, but yeah, I even introduced my uncle to that because he's not played uh, the remake. And he, even he said, How overpowered and fast is he? And he is. But that's the new style of Nemi. Anyway. <laughs> I hate being chased in video games. I was on about uh, Resident Evil 7 with my cousin Luke, who was in the chat earlier. He's uh, recently uh, played it. Uh, for the first time it's like i've completed it once i've never been back for it like i will go back to it soon i've played once on this channel like i said earlier don't watch it because it's shite it's not that oh it's not a good quality Stop. don't you dare find that one. right yeah we're done in here aren't we we done we done um but yeah the problem is you get chased by all the cray cray family members the bakers you get chased by them on i hate it i hate being chased in games i can just about cope with this because i've got used to it to play it so much but it's like um yeah it's like on the uh the remake it really is fast and uh sometimes you just god you hardly even have a chance i hate it so we want to be there's a lot of pick that we acquired from the police station Oh, I don't know what them things are actually called. I can't remember. I don't want to be spoiled with it. I don't want to take up too many inventory spaces. <clears throat> I 
Oh yeah, Bane 85. Are you on about um the new RE movie? Uh, I went to see um yeah, I went to see the new RE movie when it uh, came out the cinema. Welcome to Raccoon City. Um, you know what? I actually enjoyed it. It has so many. Oh, I'm... honestly, I'm not. I'm not even. Not even taking chances. Not surprised the YouTubers I watch actually do run around and um, try and avoid it. I mean, if we were playing, if we weren't playing on light mode, then I would um, probably avoid these. But I'll still collect it anyway. It's part of the fun, isn't it? Um, yeah, what I would definitely say is uh, what the other uh, RE YouTubers say, the big ones who I've watched when they did their like review of it and everything. Uh, don't believe everything like you, you see online sort of thing. Like it, It's got absolutely loads of hate online. And just go in there with like a clear head and just see what you make of it. It's by no means amazing at all. However, nice. I think I can't remember what we use that for, you know. Um, <clears throat> yeah, taking no chances with the dogs. Um, it has lots of uh, video game references in it, uh, which is really cool. Um, yeah, the, they the characters are, are very off. <laughs> I've got to say they're, they're pretty off. The best one is probably Chris. Um, Claire's all right as well. Um, but yeah. We just work out we'll stick these gunpowder but we don't we don't even need them um power cable i don't know if we do we need that like a bit later i'm gonna shove that to one side i might keep the blue gem because i'm sure i'm sure we're close ish to the um the clock where we need to use it i think as i say i'm not the best on this um oh man there's loads Oh. See, that's what happens when you try and run the dogs around. Why well, you'd be nice, doggies. Um, but yeah, I don't know if any of you guys um, have seen the uh, new Resi movie. They wrecked Leon, by the way. They absolutely wrecked him. I was like, what have you done to our guy? It's so sad. Right, we're taking any chances with that. Oh, just the one, that's fine. There is another one, is it up here on the wall? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We are messing around. So up here, I'll show you. We um we need to get a battery for that. There we go. So we can't yet operate that lift, so we're gonna ditch that for now. Good game hated the water puzzle though. Was that the Was that in our E3 remake? Is that what you're talking about? I can't remember which one. You won't think I'd only played it the other day. I'm like Dory at Find Nemo. I I, uh, I forget everything. Right, I, I assume I think we go this way. Hell yeah. Carlos. The original Carlos is ace. I think they nailed the new one as well. Uh, I think he's, he's really good for a modern Carlos. But this one, this retro one's awesome. It really is good. Um, but yeah. Uh, hello from southern Sweden, from Glenn Pearson. Thanks for uh, tuning in, man. I appreciate it. All over the world, we've had Russia, Sweden. Hell yeah. We've got um, Scott from London as well. Uh, so yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys, from all over. A cheeky city guide. Dear citizens, thanks to kind and generous people of Umbrella and <laughs> kindly donating the G-Virus to everyone. This is a peaceful and friendly city. The vast donations from Umbrella Inc. have been used for welfare work, the construction of public utilities, and to help maintain public peace. I'll drink the G Fuel when there's a cutscene. Uh, in 1992, it was my fifth year as mayor of our beautiful city. It was then that through many donations and hard work, our city was able to rebuild the municipal building, create a state-of-the-art hospital. In honour of these fine accomplishments, I was awarded... With a grand statue the same year, the statue rests in the municipal building. I came to this city as an engineer more than 35 years ago. I made contributions to the electric systems and to the installation of the cable car. I've pledged to follow the tradition of this fine city and will devote my life to its prosperity. The mayor of the city, Michael Warren. Oh, we missed something. We haven't, have we? 
Use a lock pick. Hell yeah. Oh, nice. We got it. I'm just sure that there's a cutscene. It's got to be any time now. I'm just thinking, have I not done something to trigger it? I waited for our car last. We saw him a second ago. Hell yeah. There we go. What's that? G fuel time. Calm down, lady. I'm no zombie. Calm down, lady. My name's Carlos. I ain't a lady, Carlos. Corporal of Umbrella's biohazard countermeasure <laughs> force. What's your name? Jill, did you just say you belong to Umbrella's army? Yeah. We came all the way out here to save you civilians. But the mission went bad the minute we landed. How did he find me? So the best thing to do is blow him up. So I think if you run to the base, he's still running round ragged. So hide inside the kitchen. He runs riot Over still. Here. So go in the kitchen. Absolutely fearless. <laughs> Badass. Are you crazy? You could have barbecued both of us. Yeah, well, that didn't happen though, did it, Carlos? <laughs> Look at the state of it now. Ace. Absolutely awesome. I don't think there's anything down there. I never usually go down there. I don't. I don't know if Carlos is still going to be there if we go down there. So. What? You're kidding. I think I took too long to get out because he doesn't usually get up. I think it's because I, I was taking ages. There we go. <laughs> I need to ask you something. Survive the kitchen Why explosion. Why did Umbrella send your team here? Our mission is to rescue the civilians. How kind of you. Considering Umbrella caused all this in the first place, those liars. Look, we're just mercenaries, hired hands. No time for talking. If you can believe me, then join us. Think about it. <laughs> he was brave. Said he's from Umbrella. Oh, shit! He made me jump. <laughs> Through here. I think this is the save room. See, this is the thing. I forget. I still forget. I chill. And then he, he keeps us on our toes. Literally. Um... Oh, that's fine. There was no reason to come in here anyway. I've already got the blue gem. So I think if I go out of here... Oh, there was reason to go in here. Right. I think we've pretty much got everything. <clears throat> yes, we've got an Emmy chasing us for a bit longer. Oh! Oh! How did he miss us? Nemi, you've been around since what? 19... Is it 1999 it came out, this? I think. I mean, it took like a year to make or something, I think. Oh, hang on. <laughs> I told you I had to run him around. Honestly, why? how have we got the time to do this? <laughs> I proper pushed my luck. We still need the other. Right, keep running, keep running. Just keep running. Hell yeah. I think he comes in here as well. Yeah, he does. We've got a breather for like two minutes. Yeah, Scott, I bet it's so... Um, I, bet, I bet it's so uh, busy. Being in London. I've got a cousin who lives there. And, uh, yeah. It must be so busy, man. Close-up shot of a zombie. Say cheese! It says scoop on the backside. What's scoop all about? Uh, yes, yeah, super shot. I'm playing it on the PC. I am, man. I am indeed. Uh, now I've got an upgraded PC setup. It's, it's so funny. I splash out all this money on an upgraded PC setup, then I go and play games from the 90s on it. That's so me. Such a me thing to do. Go play 90s Resi on it. That's fine. Um, but no, I did uh, the other day, I put on a, a recording of a modern upcoming psychological horror game called Stray Souls. The demo is out, uh, so I thought it'd be fun to just jump on the demo. Um, so yeah, I will be um, playing some modern games as well. There we go. Let's see the gem. There are some zombies rooming around. Reporter's memo. 
At least I've found the evidence I need to prove that the cannibal disease is indeed happening in this city. One man actually ate people to death. He was like a savage animal tearing away a new flesh. It was completely disgusting. I've heard rumours that many people are also suffering from this disease now. However, the cause of this disease is not yet known. Is this another mystery of the present disease? I will have to check on it. They have placed Raccoon City under martial law because of the cannibal disease. I've lost contact with the media outside of the city, but I won't give up. As a journalist, I won't keep my eyes shut and walk away. I have a duty to the people and my profession. I don't think the disease has spread nationwide yet. I believe that this city holds the key to its creation and cure. In fact, I'm sure of it. The military has set up blockades around the city to keep people from escaping and spreading the disease. Most of the citizens have either died or have come in contact with the disease. I know that it is the right decision to quarantine the city, but I can't help but pity myself. If I am infected or eaten, it doesn't matter. My fate is already sealed. All I have is my journalism. I won't give up until I solve the mystery of this deadly disease. I have just discovered that the disease is not spread through the air, but by some other means. It was all the rats in the sewers and stuff, wasn't it? Roaming around. I thought that was something. Photo C. The police have been destroyed. That, that is a really... I was trying to get it so the text wasn't over the photo. Really iconic photo. I love that on the uh, the opening uh, FMV. Awesome. Yeah, Scott, the new RE movie sucked. I kind of get it. I'm, I'm kind of with you on that. But at the same time... It, it sucks, but I enjoyed it. It's definitely better than the Paul Anderson movies, a million percent. And I, I believe... Oh, bloody white. Yeah, I'm still fine, it's fine. Um, yeah, I believe um, that it is better than the, the Paul Anderson ones because, um, yeah, that's what I said. I believe it's like the closest we'll get to Resi on a movie. It's hard to capture it. You can't capture what is on these retro resi games the first three you cannot capture what's on them i don't think there's anything that's fine it's off the inside yeah, that. um you just can't get it on nevi how do you get from there stop with your acrobatics we ain't got time for that shit um but yeah it's just uh it's difficult to capture on film, um, but I did enjoy it. It comes out February seventh on, um, you know, to like DVD, Blu-ray, uh, and I will be getting the Blu-ray for sure, for sure. I can't remember which way. Uh, this is the way to the cable car. This one. Let's say I'm not the absolute best. I think you're playing dead, aren't you? No. Nope. Yeah. They'll get up soon. Yeah, I knew it. You're playing dead. Does she? St I wanted to see if she stamps on or kick kicks her head off like Claire. Cool. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Horror games like Obscure, Suffering, Fatal Frame, yeah, hell yeah. Uh, Fatal Frame, I think that's uh, that's like Project Zero, right? I've got the first and second on PS2. Almost managed to get Project Zero 3. <laughs> See you, dogs. Um, from CEX um, a little while ago. They had it in stock in my local. It was like 70 quid, and I had the credit for it as well. I had the CEX credit. But um, it had no Manuel. And if the game don't have Manuel, it can't come in the collection. If you don't have Manuel, you're not coming in. Um, <laughs> yeah. So unfortunately, I had to pass on it. I think that's what... We need the power cable for this, I think. Mechanics memo. I know you're intimidated by your new job, Kevin, so let me tell you how to make sure that you and your trains get along just fine. You see, these carriages were made in 1968 and then imported from Europe. Sometimes they get rickety, but they still work because they are simple, stubborn and strong. We can always depend on them. If they have a bad day and a malfunction, you'll need to take a look at their circuits for any trouble. Once you discover what's wrong, you'll be able to fix it easily. I'm sure you'll be able to avoid these nasty little mal malfunctions if you check the parts every day. These old trains will surely have problems if you don't manage to check them out. <laughs> that, that's just Trans Pennine Express all over, in it, really? Just remember that if you need to replace anything, you have to choose a suitable part. When I say suitable, I mean that even if you can't find another original part, you better find something that works good enough. Even with regard to oil, you must always, always prepare 
good quality oil for these trains. Never forget, Kevin, that a man may be trailers, but a machine won't. Right, so now you power cable. We got it. Fuse and mixed oil. So we need those. You're one of the survivors from the rescue team, right? I just ran into your teammate, Carlos. How did a girl like you manage to survive? Hey, I'm an no ordinary so civvy. I'm a member of STARS. <laughs> Stars? You mean the RPD Special Force Team? Ah. Hey, is someone wounded back there? Sorry guys, I was just checking my phone. 15 watching. Sweet. Thanks everyone for tuning in, I appreciate it. Oh, this looks bad. Oh, they're coming. Get ready. Ah, ah. Fire. Fire. Stay together. Calm down. You're safe now. Everything is going to be okay. Right, so we've got to get the uh, parts now. Yeah, um, obscure. So, Jill, did you decide to help us out? It like looks like we're the only ones who survived. We should work together. No, we can't trust her. Why? But Sergeant, we need her help. Our unit's down to you, me, and Lieutenant Mikhail. That's it. And How Mikhail's can you not trust bad. Jill's if cute blue eyes? Look at her looking. We won't be walking away from this mission. Then let's go over our plan. We're moving to the clock tower area, which is the designated landing zone for the extraction chopper. Once we get there and give the signal, the chopper will fly in and pull us out. That's a lot of ground to cover. I, I don't think we can make it on foot. The main problem we have is that the landing zone is cut off from here by the fire. So we have no choice but to use this cable car to navigate through it. Fortunately, we can also use it as a moving shield to get us through the worst areas. That works for me. Good plan, sir. Okay, people, let's get moving. Jill, I like this, this song. song. Thanks, Carlos. I like this talk about the heavy. Get to the chopper! Right. Now this is what I'm not looking forward to. We've got a bit of backtracking to do now. Use the rusty crank. We need to use that. Uh, I think that was when we was on the way to the um, the diner on those shutters. Uh, we need to use that on the substation as well because it breaks. So we actually need to use that before we go to the substation because obviously it's going to break. Um, and the wrench. We need to unscrew the bolts to get the fire hose. Is it a fire hose? Sure it is. Uh, but yeah, we've had a few comments while uh, while that uh, cutscene was still there. Um, yeah, what I was saying, I was uh, saying about those those awesome uh, them horror games. Oh, that's our first bit of help that we're gonna take. Have a green herb, Jill. Treat yourself. Fine now. Um, yeah, once I obscure the suffering, uh, I need the first obscure game. I've got the second. Um, yeah, I really need the first one. What I'll do while we're roaming around, I'll take one of these uh, green herbs. Because it's just useful like, if we just take a couple of bites on them, he swipes at us. Um, I'm sure the other bit's the substation. I'll just double check. Um, yeah, super shot. Are you going to Leeds next month, mate? Yeah, I assume that's for... You mean for the arcade club meal? Absolutely. I've actually not been to the um, Leeds venue of the arcade club. I've been to Berry several times. It's awesome. Um, I don't know if Leeds is... I've heard it's not quite as big as the Berry venue. Uh, however, yeah, I'm not going to use that yet because it's going to break the crank when we use it. Um, yeah, um, I'm still yet to visit Leeds. I'm really looking forward to it though. Absolutely, I need to check uh, what date it's been rescheduled to. I'll double check that. Oh shit. <laughs> See so if we get some headshots. <laughs> Just totally have fun with this. It's great. Closer. Okay, yeah, we take that. That's the note we uh, 
read from uh, Mayor Warren. He said he had his own statue. Snob. We put something else back there. Right, so we need to take the book back to them like little fountain figures. Um, first Resident Evil movie was beautiful. If you, yeah, referring to the Paul Anderson ones, you know what? I, I didn't mind it too much, the very first Resident movie. It's, it wasn't bad in The Hive and all that lot. It was pretty good. I love that actress as well. Is it Michelle Rodriguez? She's awesome. I think she's so good. Um, but yeah, I, I enjoyed the film. It was all right. Welcome, Scott. I'll be back, guys. Look forward to your returning, man. Thanks for tuning in. You've been here a while. Um, right, we've got quite a few things. I might even just put that back for now. Uh, I don't know if we still like, need the lockpit, so I'll keep uh, keep it there. Oh, Bane 85. I've, I've played the Metro um, Exodus and... Is it Exodus and Redux, I think? Um, when they brought out like the remasters for the Xbox One a few years ago. A good few years ago, that. Right, I can't remember at all which way to go. I'm gonna... We need to do backtracking. Um, so I, I don't know if I'm gonna proper lead us around in circles, guys. Right, so we need to be back here. We need to replace, pop the book there. And then we, I think we need to put this in his hand. Then we get the battery in return, I think. <laughs> Russian Mikhail and Nikolai, where is their vodka? I, I know, like, why are you not drinking on tonight of all night? Did you see that? Did you see that poster, by the way? Biohazard 4. That's cool, innit? That, that's, um, that eye, that was like the whole kind of advert for Resi 2, I think. Resi 2 was being advertised. I've seen it in the old magazines and stuff. Um, yeah, I know we need to backtrack like a little bit, so that's why I'm headed for it. I killed you guys! You kidding me? You're actually kidding me? Yeah, it's right away. Cool. Um, yeah, their, their Metro games were awesome. Metro Exodus and Redux. They were brilliant. Really good, man. Great from the time that was made up. I might even, uh, I wouldn't even mind streaming them to be honest with you. You're inspiring me, guys. I appreciate it. Um, haven't been to Leeds Arcade Club yet. Yeah, I'm really excited, man, because I've not been before. Right, we, yeah, we do kind of need to head back quite a bit, I think. Retro Games Fair at Leeds next month. Oh, man. I would go if I could. I'm absolutely skint. I've proper been hit, you know, with them January blues sort of thing. I, um, I'm just proper skint from, <laughs> like, getting my new setup and everything. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm not in any kind of... Uh, I can't quite... These crows ain't loyal. Uh, I can't quite splash out on some retro games like I used to. I used to proper just throw my money at it. But the hobby has gone up, like, massively. <laughs> it's really, um, yeah, it's really difficult to keep up with. Yes, I know where we are now. We can use a wrench here. Nice. So far, so good. And we kind of do. We do need to use it. Yeah. Fires, bits of what? That's it. It's so, um, so like faffy. You've probably got to get in the right stand position next to the things to use these items. Yeah, Sir Giannica, the first obscure game is good. The spirit of student life. Absolutely, I pre I, uh, agree with that. Um, Definitely. I'm heading back a bit more to the diner because I'm doing that crank. I'm sure we actually don't even need what's in there, you know. Oh, do you mind twatting, Jill? Um, but yeah, um, I did used to have Obscure, but I gave it to my mate as a present, <laughs> uh, basically. So I thought, oh, I love that. So yeah, um, so yeah, I just need to rebuy it, that's all. I played about... Oh, I'll probably play like an hour or two of it. Um, I think it'd be good co-op as well. Because there's several characters in it. And you've got to try and keep them all good if you can. Oh, we need to do this and all. Fire hose. I'll use it while we're here. Um, yeah, because they have um, some 41 still waiting. That song. So am I still waiting. So good. When it plays that in the opening FMV... Absolutely love it. Probably fills you like adrenaline. 
Um. Oh, shit. We really shouldn't have headed back. I don't think I'm gonna, you know. I've changed my mind. <laughs> I swear, I think it's just um, shotgun shells. It's not wise, guys. I'm just not putting us in a good position, so. <laughs> oh, I was almost busting. Fuck that. Nah. Um. Yeah, um, that's the back, Scott. Hope the uh, next RE movie will be better. Yeah, I think they could only improve. Put it this way, it can't get any worse. <laughs> oh, shit. Shit. I put the thing back. Oh. You just want a hug, Jill? Hell no. Nah. Oh, hell no. Nah. Um, Barry Budget. Do you remember Dino Crisis? I love that game. Yes. It's an absolute classic Ari with dinosaurs. I'd love to stream it on this what did channel. You do? Absolutely. I had no choice. It was about to turn into a zombie. It would have been a threat, so I eliminated it. But he was still conscious, wasn't he? He was as good as dead. And it took fewer bullets to kill him now than it would have if he had transformed. That was a bit harsh, wasn't it? Not now, I'm busy. Yeah, of course you are. Look at him pretending to type. Stop it, I'm busy. And then his hand's just like... <laughs> right, fine, whatever you say. Oh, I think there's a little puzzly bit here. Hang on. It's a password. It? Manager's report. Before you begin your new position, please allow me to give you some advice. Some of the medicine in the storage room are unstable and their quality will deteriorate under cha changing temperatures or humidity. Therefore, you must remember to keep the temperature the same in the storage room at all times. You should personally check it every day. Although the computer checks it around the clock, a machine is not perfect. Try and remember that a machine is no more than a tool to be used by people. You must check all personnel coming and going to the storage room. Many dangerous drugs are stored there. If any of them are missing, you have a serious problem on your hands. The door to the storage room is always locked, but when you let personnel into it, you'll need to have them hand in their documents. And above all else, remember that if you find anything suspicious, contact your boss immediately. If you forget the password to lock the door, try and remember it is a word that everyone is familiar with. Don't forget that once a new product is shipped, the password will be updated again. You can always enter the password from the terminal of the PC for administration. So, you touch this little remote, and it's usually either, I think it's Advil or Safsprin, Aquacure. There we go. Escape to Ecstasy, Aquacure. So that shall be our password. When we need to enter it, I don't know. I can't remember. Mm, access to storage is controlled by the computer. Okay. Oh, no worries, Scott. Have some work to do before I go to sleep for my job tomorrow. Hope it goes well, man. And you stay safe too. Awesome to have you by tonight, so thanks so much, man, for uh, stopping by. I really appreciate it. Awesome to have you here. So, AquaCure. That is that password. Oh. Yeah, that is BS. I typed it wrong. These damn retro computers. There we go. Yeah, as I get further through the game, I, I don't remember, like, lots of it. Uh, I'm, I'm absolutely dreading the clock tower puzzle. I've, I've got a few things written down that there's certain combinations. It all depends. Um, it depends on what time it shows on the clock. Alrighty. Or I the tip, hell yeah. Uh, we, yeah, we don't need them. We, we've got plenty, honestly. Am I plan to do any more car boot videos in the future? I am, man, yeah. Um, once you start up, hopefully in March onwards. I have to keep shaking this, you see. This cheap feels like a powder you had to water, so I don't like it like building up. I mean, you don't have the anyway. I'm just trying to keep it fresh and all that, you know. Alrighty. Turn the right way, Jill. Turn the right way. Oh, man, you're killing me. She's absolutely let me down. I can't believe it. 
She's absolutely turned the wrong way. How can you do this to me? Jill, do you realise we're live? Damn Amy, that could have been so epic. We don't have to come back through here anyway. Oh, you prick. Honestly. No, that could have been so epic. <laughs> she aimed the other way. She aimed at the, the valve, the other side of it. Stop. I'm totally not in the mood. I'm absolutely not in the mood. You don't piss off a woman, especially Jill. Let me just double check that. I, I want to get out of here, but I just want to check. Is he still... Is he still faffing? Oh, he isn't. It's Nikolai's piece. It's too bad it's broke. Yeah, of course it is. He's just smashed it up to destroy the evidence. Oh, shit. We on orange caution. Damn. I'm leading us into danger, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, shit. Oh, there's something there as well. Okay. Don't die. I need to get that shiny thing, but don't die. What's that? The crank. I'm confused. The crank and the rusted crank. Because at the substation, I'm, re I'm well confused, man. So at the substation, you use the rusted crank, don't you? And that snaps. And then you need the. Uh, Oh shit, not now! Not fucking now! Not now! Not now! Come on, Jill. Oh my god! Oh my god! Actually scared me there, because I've let her health drain. I didn't have anything on. <gasps> We're in the danger zone! Look at that limp! Look at that! We're in the danger zone! Oh damn! Oh, it's in a bad position there. My apologies. Anyway. <clears throat> I just don't get what I need that for. I don't remember being a crank crank. I remember the rusty crank, but I don't remember the crank crank. And do I even need the lock pick still? I can't really think of anything. Um, We have got a safe thing, like, near the... Um, on the way to the substation, so leave the power cable in there, it's fine. We need to, however, yeah, we need to pop that back in the guy's hand, which gives us the battery. Right, okay, we need to kind of head back folks. We've come back on ourselves, we need to kind of go back for I don't know if Nev is still going to be around. Damn. Oh, can you not? Oh shit! I can hear him. I can hear him. I don't know which way to go. <gasps> Fuck! Oh my god! I just avoided that. See, see how unchill I am once he's around. Oh shit! I really could have gone for a head there. Really could have. Uh, it would have been useful, but we can't mess around. Alright, hang on. Where are we? Where are we? Stop whispering stars, you're making me on edge. But that's the whole point of the survival horror. Nem is meant to make you all tense. No, that's this part. That's fine, Joe. Just stand there like a dip. It's fine. anything down there there's nothing of any benefit and it just kind of puts you behind and you just kind of got to um i think you just have to kind of take a long way around to where we were um yeah doddo's 88 uh gaming um yeah thanks man uh he said he uh 
enjoys watching my car boot videos. Thank you for watching them. I appreciate it, man. Um, that, I feel like I'm cluttering up the, in, the inventory with all the... I don't know what I'm doing. The, the cranks have absolutely threw me because I don't get it. I don't get why I've got a, a rusted one and then a proper one. Don't vomit on me. Um, but yeah, car boot videos will be making a return. Um, when my local car boot starts in March. I'll try anyway. I'm going to try. Yeah, we don't have the battery. Let's go this way. Um, yeah, the problem is it's kind of getting enough footage because obviously I need to make video games. Video game pickups or video game related pickups, you know. Um, I'm referring to the map, but like I don't... I can't make head and tail of it anyway. So down there for the substation... Um, hmm. We can get in, can't we? We can get into the substation. I just don't... That's throw me because I don't get what that is. Oh, stop. Get off the screen. Yeah, that's fine. We'll go to the substation. Is that round... Oh, come on. Think, damn it. Yes. That is right, isn't it? No, we didn't. Yeah, it is. Oh, man, you've really confused me. I need to get the substation, don't I? Mm. That's the problem with this game. Once you get lost, you get lost. Mm. We don't go back through the diner. Hell no. Nah. Surely not. Because that's heading towards the diner, isn't it? So, Janaki, thanks for the chat. Good luck, everyone. I have to go to bed. Miss the accent. <laughs> Miss the accent. It's great. I love it. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Glad you like the accent. I, I can't stand my accent, man. I don't, I don't even feel like I have one. Um, I really don't think so. Where are you looking, Jill? Where are you looking? I just don't want to get caught out. Yeah, if we'd have headed to the diner, this is like a longer way round. Um, yeah. Still need to get a fuse. We need something to mix that oil with as well. What is it we've got? Is it oil additive? Yeah, we need to mix it to something. Oh, fuck off! Oh, you're kidding! You're kidding! We ain't after shit. There we go, the music stops. Fine. I can't mess around with them, guys. Can't mess around with the dogs. <laughs> Right, so I'll put this, um, it's like this sun dialy thing in his uh, hand. Provides us with the battery. We've got what we need for the substation, haven't we? We've got the crank, we've got the wrench. So I think we'll go use them. We do need to backtrack. <gasps> it's coming off everywhere, man. So that is the, so that bit's a train, that bit's a substation, yeah. Um. Yeah, obviously we need to backtrack to put that battery in where them creatures are, where more respond, even though I killed them the first time. Rude. Um, but yeah, I'd rather clear these out of the inventory, to be honest. So, we'll do the rusty crank. Let me just check. That's a hex-edged one. Is that a hex-edged one as well? Oh, I'm checking the wrong thing. Come on, hold. Square-edged. Hex, yeah. You can't even use that anyway then, so that's for something else. I can't what it is. Oh, that must be for the old one there, the diner then. That that crank, maybe. It's just absolutely through me. don't remember being a working crank on this game. Coming up to about a, an hour and a half streaming, almost. Discard the wrench, sweet. It's freed up a, a bit of inventory space anyway. Um, yeah, hope you guys are all enjoying the live stream so far. It's so weird actually streaming and seeing people chatting. I'm always recording like offline on my own. Hey, the zombies are getting restless. I know. I can hear them. What's going on? We're fine. We've got Carlos's biceps to protect Jill. us. What's wrong? 
They're coming. They must have slipped us out. They know we're here. Hey, calm down. Any objections to my playing hero this time? What are you doing? <laughs> Carlos! He's so good, man. His dialogue. You can be my hero, Carlos. You can be our hero. You absolutely are. Right, I won't go in there yet because I don't want to trigger anything. Let me just stay here. Right. Temperature control of the oil. Right, we've got a little puzzly thing. So we need to, I think, just illuminate. The D is lit up, so we need to just illuminate that one on its own. I have no kind of solution for this at all, guys. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, hell no. Nah. There we go. It's just literally, it's all look. I, I have no kind of combination for this. What, do I have to illuminate that again? I thought it was going to give me different letters. Mm. Right, now we've got to illuminate A. It's all luck. It's all luck, guys. Oh, come on. You've got to try something, Holster. Yes, we got it. There's just nothing, you know what I mean? To There's no set thing. It's just all random. Oh, I did want to see what was in there, but there can't be anything to keep because obviously it's like cut us off now. Right. No time to sit my G fuel since we've got to get out. We've got to reunite with our hero, Carlos. Carlos! Oh, man down! Relax, I'm not dead yet. Are you okay? I'm fine. Uh, that hero stuff is harder than it looks. It's cheesy dialogue, man. I just, I just still made it. Yeah, they've still made him slightly cheesy in the remake, but... Ouch, my ears are ringing. We both should be deaf by now. Okay, I'm gonna scrounge up some equipment. There might not be any at our destination. See, I get why they've changed it, because this Carlos, it wouldn't fly nowadays. It's too cheesy, but back then, if that was 90s, that was... That was just Carlos, you know. Cool. So machine oil and oil additive, there we go, got the mixed oil, we've got the power cable in our inventory box, we just need the fuse, so I'm going to keep that with us just in case we need it, but I think it's probably to use near the diner, I reckon so, um, and yeah that's it really, um, I'll probably, I might nip back and get the shotgun, um, sure we don't need it for anything, I might keep it on us because I just don't know, absolutely threw me ass. Battery. Oh shit. I did leave some roaming, didn't I? He's playing dead and all. We ain't having that. They all want Jill's feet. Stop. He got well close then. Alright, so back with them. Um, I don't even know what you call them creatures either. They're kind of like the Resi 3 version of liquors, aren't they? <laughs> Okay, so back there, I need to work out. It's not that far away. It's just, yeah, the problem is, it. at least my issue anyway, once I'm lost on the game, I am lost. I 
Archie Robertson says hi. Hi, Archie. Thanks for tuning in. I appreciate, man. Um, that's towards a diner, isn't it? I'm going to nip out here. Bane 85. It's hard to believe this came out. The graphics were great. Look how far we've caught. I know. Like, back, back then, they looked amazing. It's so crazy when... There we go. You know with them, that door style, don't you? Um, you just can't believe it, can you? Like... <laughs> It's absolutely groundbreaking back then. Um, I mean, this now, it, it still looks nice. It's just polished up a little bit. They've gone now. I swear they were around when we last went through this this area. Random, confusing me. And then, yeah, like now, it, they're so... Oh, it's so incredible, the graphics now. Harry 3 Remake's graphics are amazing. All of them are, though. I don't know what um, if any of you guys have got like you know the latest generation consoles, but I've got um, I've got an Xbox Series S and PS5. Um, that's quite a while since I got the PS5, um, obviously because of the uh, the, si the situation. We're in a bit of a sitch, aren't we? About trying to get older one, uh, but I, I managed to at my local game. I think is that locked? Yeah. Maybe I've done a bit. Um, yeah, I finally managed to get one back in November, so I've had a couple of months now. Um, I mainly play on Xbox. I am actually using uh, an Xbox controller. I'm using my Series X controller. Um, I just think it's really nice, just really comfy to, to play on. Um, yeah, by the way, if any of you are wondering, obviously I'm playing on PC, but I absolutely don't use PC controls. I won't be able to play this on a PC at all. It's just, it's just me. I'm terrible. I'm not saying it's bad or anything. Um, it's bad for me. <laughs> I'm like, great. Um... Right, so we've got power transfer to manual mode. The old system is prone to short circuiting. Be careful not to let it exceed maximum levels. Will you set this device to manual mode? Yep, so that allows us to mess around with this. I can't remember what number we need it to. Again, guys, this is all just trial and error. That's too high. Hang on a sec. Is it on here? Yeah. Low voltage control room. 15 to 25 volts we need for that. And 115 to 125. Okay. I can't remember all those numbers. <laughs> right, let's go. Let's go. Red. Um, blue. Nice. That's the first one. So, the thing is, guys... Um, I think if you unlock one of these, you go in, you collect, there is a key item in one of these, and then you come out, you'll be triggered in the cutscene, and then you will uh, have to make a decision. And I think on one of them, um, I think you have to, like, blow up, like, overload all the power supply to, um, get time to be wise, um, to, like, fry the zombies, if you choose that, I think. Um, otherwise, I think you head to the emergency exit and you ditch the place. The best thing to do is unlock both the doors. Um, yeah. Unlock both. So we won. I might do blue, red, red. No. We, yeah, we need to like overload this. So. 115 to 125. So red, blue, red, red. No. We probably need. I might do. Red, red. Blue, red. Nah, still not done it. Uh, it's times one time. Yeah, let's have a lot. Red. Yeah, obviously, like, blue decreases it and red increases. Is it like. It might be either maybe. It might do red, blue. Red. Oh no, it needs to be red again, doesn't it? Otherwise, it's gonna power it down. Hmm. I'll do red, 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 blue. There we go. Get that. Yeah, it's after you enter one of these. So that's a fuse. There we go. So we've collected that. I think we might trigger it now because we've collected the fuse. However, we have opened the other door, so we have access to it. There we go. So 
we are faced with the option. You either head to the emergency exit, that door that was uh, like locked, or increase electricity output. So the best thing to do, fry all the zombies. Let's have some fun. Uh, it's best to kill them all, obviously. Like, don't leave them running around. Don't leave them roaming. So we've done that. Um, and yeah, obviously we've already opened that. Um, I think, actually, I think if you haven't already opened that other door, you can reload it and stuff, but then you have to kind of do the puzzle again or something to uh, reopen it. It's something like that. But yeah, I have my own kind of, you know, routine on how I do things. Cool, grenade launcher. So yeah, that's what you, the benefit you get from the second room. Um, and yeah, we're done here now. Yeah, Bayonetta Five. I remember Gran Turismo 2 came out and I was amazed looking back now. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, like the old Gran Turismo games, definitely. Um, or like the old Crazy Taxi. I remember uh, being at my mate's house and um, I was playing Dreamcast with him and his older brother and he was like, oh, look at that for a picture. Like, we, you know, we, we tuned it, all the Dreamcast in on the telly, the good old days, tuned it all in. When it appeared on the channel, we was like, oh my god, it was absolutely epic. Um, I don't believe we need to take the battery for anything. I don't think so. So right, where are we yeah. headed now? We just headed back to the substation, I think. Um, yeah. Just need to remember oh. which way I'm going. That's right, I think we came from that way. Don't get lost. You're doing a great job so far, because usually you get lost, lost. Oh, we need to go in... Into the best way to the substation. Oh yeah, it is that way I think. I'm trying to remember them kind of them kind of doors. Right, through here. That's fine. Do we need anything from there? Oh, power cable. Hell yeah. Then we've got everything. It's gone rather smoothly actually for me. It really has. Usually I'm like chasing around a bit more, you know. It is confusing at times. I remember when I went back, you know, to replay it after years. Because I was a little kid. Um, I was like, what the hell? Mm, I should have took some assault rifle ammo, really. Have some fun with that. That's fine. There'll be another save area soon. You know what, I might just take, make a save. I'm just right, like I've played for an hour and a half, we've not saved it so far. We ain't going for any kind of record or speed run or anything. Let's just be safe and just give it a save. <laughs> I'll kind of be more, a bit more at rest then. And uh, yeah, I'll pick up some AR ammo as well. Why not, it's there to be used. There we go. I'm just confused by that, like, I, I don't know if we need it anytime soon. I'm just keeping it on as just in case. I think you get an unlimited ink ribbon on this, yeah, there we go. Right, make a cheeky save. We're still carrying on, though. I ain't ditching it. <laughs> That's one from when I had a little test run the other night. You see the time, 3.49am. I've had some late nights um, since I got my setup. Um, pretty much finished all my setup like about a week or so ago you know like when everything arrived so I, I literally invested in like loads of different stuff um yeah and it's like oh man it was so complicated it's like first setting this up um yeah all my stream so it's something i've never done before i've done game capture um hooked up my consoles via the elgato software um yeah, I've not actually streamed and everything. It's just getting everything right, you know. And I remember, I remember raging, like, for ages. Oh, will you piss off? We're having a nice chat. Just come and ruin it. Not today, Nemi. Uh, well, not tonight. Um, but yeah, I remember getting all ragey. And then I checked YouTube. And it was uploading to YouTube, my stream, in 480p. <laughs> I want 1080p at 60 frames for a freaking second. That's what I was aiming for. 
No wonder it looked terrible. I was going mad. I was going for all my settings. I was like, what is going on? And I was looking. I was like, maybe it's not OBS. Maybe it's not my stuff. Is it YouTube? And yes, it was YouTube. Unbelievable. Um, I don't think we've got a boss coming up. Oh, we've got this. Okay. I don't think you even have to shoot this one. You just have something to do down here. Right. Uh, yeah, I don't even know what to call that. Um, yeah, what you have to do... The switch for the elevator of the ladder seems like it's not functioned due to lack of power. Oh, I get you. I get you. Okay. So, it's a... Right, what we need to do, we've led it over there. I think we have to quickly, that's it. Switch that, then run. And then because it's over there, we can go back here and switch it. Oh, I've got the wrong switch. Yeah, he's going to appear that one again. Oh, I've got to be quick, man. There we go. <laughs> We've done it now. Alright, progress. We've not done too bad for like an hour and a half. Yeah. Oh yeah. We're not really going to come back here, so I'm not too bothered about using ammo on the dogs. Let's go. YouTube crazy at the minute. I've got a notification on and it didn't tell me you was live. Oh, frustrating. Oh, bless you, man. I know, that's annoying. I know, uh, time's been ticking on tonight, man. It's been putting all our things. It's the fuse now. I know, I was I was going mad, like, just, you know, trying to get everything ready and then I post it on my social, like on my Instagram anyway. That Here, was take this. Thanking you. Um... But yeah, YouTube can be a, a bit of a pain okay. for its notifications uh, and Nikolai settings. won't be joining us. I understand. I'll operate the cable car. Let's go. Carlos the hero. No, don't come any closer. Stay away. Carlos charging there. He's just dying to be the hero. It's looking good. <laughs> He's looking good. He's cruising at two, two miles an hour. Smile and wave, Jill. Smile and wave, Nemi. <laughs> Welcome to the 90s, guys. Oh, don't you start turning, for God's sake. I've not even got the means to fight a boss right now. I hope not. I hope we can You're fucking kidding me, aren't you? You're kidding me! What's going on? What's going on? I don't remember this. Fuck! Do we do we try and get off the thing? Oh, don't say I'm gonna restart, this will be pretty embarrassing. I'll be saved. Fuck! Can we try and get off? Oh, guys, I've got nothing. I didn't even know. Oh, my God, take pity on me, please. I've got nothing. Oh, I've got these. Carlos, give us a flame round, so that means they'll work good. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. I might die, guys. I think I might die. This is because I don't remember. Can I go back? Can I go back through? Jim, oh, can. Get out of the cable car now. God, for that, I thought I was going to die. In front of my two subscribers Honey. watching. <laughs> My god! I thought I was gonna die and I thought, no, surely you don't have to fight him on here. That's 
scene's good in the remake as well. That is good. Mihail. Mihail. F's in the chat to pay respects. No, the brakes are out. <laughs> oh, I think the best thing is jump out. It's useless. We'll do that anyway because it's more dramatic. I don't think the emergency brake does anything. I think it's like the less effective option. I'm sure it is. Yeah, I think we did right. <laughs> yeah, we did right. It's the more dramatic option, isn't it? Oh, I shit myself with Nebby. Why did I even try to square up to him on the train? Oh, where was Carlos? <laughs> Driving us at two miles an hour. Many of them. There's kind of two minutes piece in this game. Something behind this. What a tower key. Love it. I don't think there's anything else of any benefit. I think we good. Oh, he's quick moving. Right. What do I do? Oh, I won't save yet, it'll be alright. We've not long saved it. Just checking through. Oh, I'll have to have a look at... Um, I'm, I'm proper dreading the clock tower puzzle now. Because, uh, yeah, I think there can be, like, ball combinations or something. Surely we don't need the crank here. I'm going to leave that. Um, I have the tendency... Or shall I wait till... We'll bring that with us, we might as well. Um, I can't have my inventory looking all um, confusing. Just give me a sec. Get rid of that. Right, I need them there. Handgun. Um, I might take a grenade launch, I don't know. I might do, just in case things get a bit messy. Because we've got lots of shotgun shell. Well, we've got some, yeah. Um... Right, I've lost all my stuff. Where's my stuff that I was... There we go. <laughs> so, first day of the clock tower key. I think that's looking alright. That's looking pretty strong. I'll wait until I get another hit and then I'll take first day because... I always have the tendency, I don't actually... Let me just double check. There's, there's no other door, is there? There is just just that one and just that. Yeah, that's fine. I've got it confused in another room. Yeah, I always have the tendency. I usually always just get, you know, like the one bite. Then once one yellow cosh, I'll take a green herb. And then I end up, like, depleting myself with my green herb resources. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hey, yo, Carlos. I saw you two minutes ago. Well, we both managed to survive. Maybe we can start helping each other again. Yeah, it's been rough. But we can rest now. No, we're the only ones left. There's no rest for the wicked. Too right. Here's a gift for you. Another one. He's such a charmer. He's proper showers with gifts. I don't know why, but I know for a fact that Nemi hates freeze rounds. I don't know why. You just don't like him. Why can't we just stick together? Everyone's always obsessed with splitting up. <clears throat> Art picture postcard. Picture postcard of antique clocks. The phone verse is printed. Give your soul to the goddess. Put your hands together to pray before her. Clock tower puzzle solved. That's everything we need to know. Clearly. <laughs> no, it's, it's like the most hated puzzle of this game. Easily. Or even of like, I reckon, quite confident, one of the most hated puzzles of the RE franchise. Right, so we came from that way, so we've got that room, that room. Yeah, I thought this one was locked. God of Time is extra for the key. I don't like walking around with caution, but... Yeah, we'll just take like another hit, and then I'll, I'll take a first hit.
an old music box, stuff written on the lid. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know if you have to input like the opposite or something on another music box. It's just a little puzzly bit here. Um, no point taking them shells. Clock tower map. James Bevis, great soundtrack, got it on CD. It's incredible, isn't it? It really is. Um, I'll take that, actually. I hate going round on caution. Um, and yeah, I kind of kind of dicing with death sometimes, waiting to take another hit um, before I take another one. It's melodies out of order, something written on the lid. So there's nothing else to do with it then, is there? You have to do it somewhere, I can't think where it is. It's somewhere. So you need the... yeah, that's fine. So I know the melody of how it should sound. It's that first one, U, D, U, U, D, U. And then the D, U, D, D, U, D. That was uh, it out of... Uh, out of sync. We use up some more of these. I just I love the assault rifle for like just really like claustrophobic rooms and spaces. Look at look at that. You made that obvious. I will take it because it will help us. That's the problem because we've been spoiled because I'm playing in light mode. Um, yeah, you kind of get get a bit too greedy and over encumbered. <laughs> Like on Skyrim. Right. We've opened the lock. Anything with this? Looks like it's not been used for a long time. As I said, my memory's a little, a little bit foggy as we get later on in this game. Because I, I played like the, you know, just like the, the city bit. I just played that loads. But this bit, I didn't really... Um, I've not played it as much as the city part anyway, do you know what I mean? I'm more used to the, them puzzles. Right, I've just... I've, I've run around for like no reason, but I was trying to see if there's anything else. Yeah, I love the Magnum. The Magnum's awesome, in it? Absolute beast of a weapon. That, what I do, I, well, I try and do like, on all my games, like, I try not to even... Um, where was that? Where was the box in there? I feel like I need to use the box again, so we're totally, uh... It does say save room. If it's a save room, then it should have a box in there, shouldn't it? I need to deposit some more stuff. It's getting cray-cray again. Sorry, guys. Um, yeah. If I rule in, like, all the resi games, I, I try so hard not to... Oh, stop. Um, yeah, I try not to touch the Magnum until the end boss. The key is always to save the Magnum until the end, if you can. Try not to touch it. it. Makes me feel so much safer when I've got it like loaded with magnum rounds. Um, I don't know whether to keep that. I don't know if when there's going to be like a a thingy, a, a face off with Nemi, because there is at some point, but I just can't remember when. Ah, uh, that's the thing. Like my memories are really foggy with the uh, uh, later on in this game. So I'll do a little bit more and I'll make another save. Um, yeah, there's nothing worse. I've made pretty decent progress in like a couple of hours, what are we? Yeah, coming up to about two hours on the stream. I thought there was another roving in here. Leave him chilling. Right, so we unlocked that. Just one up in there. I hope we're all well tonight on a school night. Is it a school night for you guys? Well, work night. <laughs> um, oh, that led back into the thing. He did it. My bad. We need the other room, don't we? Um, led back into the, the hall. Yeah, hope we're all well. Uh, yeah, the reason I'm streaming tonight is because I've got a few nights off work now. I've just been on a couple of... Oh. <laughs> just in here. Honestly. There's a save in here anyway. That's our key. Cool, cool. Um, oh, actually, we should be we should be picking these up. I've neglected a couple of these. My bad, my bad. Because we can make some magnum ammo, can't we? My bad. 
Oh. Remind me to make some when we're back. Hang on. Right, does that mean there's a boss coming up soon? Hang on. Hmm. I thought you could combine it. Mm. Let me just... Let me just examine. There's all the key. To put a round shape object. Winder key. You sure? You sure? Mm. Okay. Let's ditch them for the minute because we're going to make some gunpowder seas. Because then we can make some magnum ammo. Yeah, that's pretty dumb of me actually. I've neglected picking some up throughout the game. We need the reloading tool as well, don't we? That's way back. I ditched that right at the start of the game. Cool. Let's just do a little bit of mixing, guys. Um, Gunpowder C. Can you make a triple C one? It's been ages since I've done this. Nice. There we go. Maximum amount of magnum bullets there. Gunpowder CCC. That is living the dream. Look at that. Look at how many magnum bullets. Um, I feel like I'm going to give it another save because I'm feeling a bit uneasy now because... Um, put these back a sec. Because the, uh, the bit of dust fell from the ceiling, so that means shit's going to go down shortly. So, we're taking these with us. Yeah, I'm going to make a save. Three first days at Shoy, that's got to be enough. If not, it's rather embarrassing, Holster. Yeah, we'll do another save. I'll, I'll do it on a separate one. Um... Shame not to use it now. I'm taking it with me. I'm taking the, the magnum with me. I know all that ammo. I need to really, don't I? I'm being too cautious. <laughs> We're not going to use all that on the final boss, are we? <laughs> oh, shit. Alrighty. Oh, damn it. Just get out of the way. Have all that fun it happened off screen. Let's have a bit of fun. Music stop, that's fine. Right, where do we need to go now? You're confusing me. Oh, we haven't been upstairs yet, have we? Cool. Did I take the freeze rounds? Oh, I didn't take the freeze rounds. Give me a sec. Nemi don't like freeze rounds. I forgot to take them. Have I seen Scream 5 ads? No, I've not yet. I've really been wanting to go see that. Um, I've been waiting. Um... Well. Yeah, I've been waiting to uh, go with my mum to the cinema because uh, we love our horrors. So we, all, we always go together to see the horrors. Uh, last one we went to see was the Resident Evil movie. Welcome to Raccoon City. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Scream 5. I was um, I rewatched the first one when it was Halloween. I bought the um, triple like collection on Blu-ray, the first three. Because um, I've got the fourth one kicking around on... I don't know if it's Blu-ray or DVD. It might be DVD, actually, but I'll upgrade to the Blu-ray one anyway at some point. But yeah, I have got it kicking around. Um, so yeah, it, it was only cheap on Amazon. I think it was about, I think it was about twelve ninety-nine or something for like the first three movies. I'm dying to watch it. Oh shit! Actually, you can have a magnum bullet. Ah, oh. no, we're just getting vomed on. Oh, I hate the little ones. They're the worst. We've been poisoned. We have as well, haven't we? Bollocks. There'll be one around. There'll be one around. Oh, shit. What was that? Was there an explosive barrel there? I didn't see it. It must have been off screen. Fuck. See what happens when I try and show off, guys. 
sea bane. That's why I don't use a magnum because I show off and then I get poisoned. I'm sure there's a blue herb up here anyway. Oh no, they're in. Oh, charming. Uh, bane's off. Yeah, yeah. Catch you on the next one, man, for sure. Thanks, man. Oh, I left the the keys. My bad. I left the keys. Bollocks. Oh shit. Right. I don't know whether to. I'm gonna use the cord. For some reason, I think maybe electricity might be a bit more effective on him. Because we use a bit of electric at the end, don't we? And I ain't paying for the electric. I ain't paying the bill. See you later, Nemi. Yeah, I just don't feel like using the light. I don't feel like it. You blind him temporarily, but it's not really enough, is it? Oh, mate, don't. I totally shouldn't have got them spiders, should I? I wish I'd have left him roaming about. Squashing them. Can you imagine twatting them spiders off the wall? <laughs> right. I need to work out where I'm going. Map. Um, that don't cure poison, does it? We need a blue and a green, I think. Mm. Right. Go, go in this one. See, told you. Not the best at RE3. Back this way. Yeah, I left the bloody keys in there. I wonder why I had too much space left. I don't know actually where to use the keys. Have we been spoiled with some blue herbs? I, I don't know where to get them from. We need to hope that we find some. Winder key and bezel key. We'll have to take them. Um... Actually, get rid of the flame. I've, I've got to keep a couple of spaces. I don't think that's going to cut it, you know, for poison. No, it ain't going to cut, is it? Let me just combine them because they're annoying me. There we go. No, I didn't think it did. Oh well. Um, right. Mmm. Told you my memory's foggy at this part. We've got a locked room. Oh, I'm getting confused which room this is. I absolutely lose my bearings. Right, so it's not this one. So go out that one. See, I don't know if one of these keys worked up there. Where we stop. Dear, this is <laughs> it has totally taken a turn for the worse. Damn! Don't just gonna work. Shit. Right, I'm gonna get grabbed. No escape from that. Just give me a sec. Give me a sec. Nemi, give me chance. I managed to escape that. Right, let's head back up. He's going to be such a nuisance, isn't he? Um, I need to test these keys up here because I have no idea. Um, surely one of them's got to work. I can't even combine them either. Don't, Emmy. I hate when he's chasing us. I'm so not chill. Surely there's got to be something or else I don't know what to do. Ornamental co- oh, there's a okay. cool. Oh, don't say we've got a face off him down here. Just got it here. Oh, up the ladder. I thought he was going down. I thought that was going to be the boss battle down there. Because like, there's, there's like a giant worm or something, isn't there? Sweet, okay. Right, so we needed UDU, UDU. I think that's the one um, that was in tune. Silver gear, sweet. Silver gear, no idea. Oh man, this is awful that we got poison though. There's no blue herbs anywhere. What am I meant to do about that? And that was me showboating with the Magnum. See, I try to do it. 
we don't use that here, do we? I'm just gonna try, but I don't think we do. No, that'd be too easy. We need it for something soon. Right, let's go to the music box. Such a nice melody, it's great. Right, so we want... <clears throat> oh, that wasn't even in tune. So we want up. Up, up, down, up. Cool, so next. Up, down, up. I'm, <laughs> I'm probably like moving my head because I'm trying to... So we want D. Right, guys, this should sound sweet. This should sound beautiful. Does it just end? Oh no. Oh, bollocks. I've just done it. Oh, I have. I thought, I thought I'd have to do the switch again. I thought I'd reset it or something. Oh, you're kidding. Up, down, up, up, down, up. No way. We've got to do it the opposite. Right, so we'll do down, down. Got to do it the opposite. And then next, and then. And next, down, up, down. I don't get how that would be right, though. <clears throat> we don't want it sounding like that. Down, up, down, down, down. No, it didn't give us the option to play, did it, when I did it the first time? Oh, come on. Right, we've got to do it the first way again. Apologies, I'm such a mediocre host. Do apologise. Right. So down, up, down, down, up, down. Up. Oh, we need to do it all the other way. I'm sorry, this is so time consuming. Up, down, up. I think I pressed exit, no I pressed end and I think I needed I think I need to just press back and then play, that was the problem Apologies, it's been a while guys I knew what I was trying to do It's not me, it's the game, I always blame the game Play It didn't give me that option last time, I swear, I was just being blind that's more like it sounds beautiful. I'd love a music box with this playing. Sweet. This is the Kronos key. Kronos chain. Sweet. The God of Time. There we go, look. Okay. Any chance for some, uh, any chance for blue herbs? Seriously. I can't believe there ain't any around. I thought there was some up here. Right. Have we got Nemi chasing us till we get to this bloody room? Oh, we ditched him.
So it's through that door and then that one, yeah. Cool. Poison from showboating against the, uh, the spiders with the magnum. Such an idiot. That's because I was encouraged. You guys are a bad influence. I was encouraged to use the magnum. All that ammo, use it now. There we go. Surely. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'll take him. Shit, there's another. Surely there's... Surely there's some blue herbs. I've got an abundance of everything else but them. Oh, how cute. Mercenary's pocketbook. Right, you guys ready? Story time. <clears throat> this is a love story by the looks of it. September 26. It's only been three hours since the mission started, but the team is down to me and Campbell. The number of zombies is far greater than we expected. There is no hope left for this city. We have already injected the antibody for the virus, but I'm not sure that it will work. I don't know if I will survive. September 27th. We managed to reach the clock tower. Out of desperation, we robbed some wounded members of their weapons and used the surviving citizens as decoys. We were taught to do this in order to survive in the battlefield, but I never enjoyed it. However, a girl showed up at the clock tower before me. She is one of the survivors. She looks just like my sister before she starved to death. September 28th. I wanted to evacuate as soon as possible, but the girl didn't. Her father insisted that he wouldn't leave the city where his beloved wife rests in peace. I, re I really wanted to save the girl, but Campbell said all I care about is our lives. That's how I felt before, but now the clock tower has become a dangerous place and I don't want to make any more mistakes. I feel that. I really feel that. Because <laughs> uh, I'm not that great. Oh, I tried to shield the guy's daughter. Um, yeah, I'm really not that great at the clock tower. I haven't even got enough uh, to pick up all them things. So, 12, 11 and 12... So, ooh, I think depending on what showing is it on the middle one, e each ball like moves so many hours. We'll have to come back to that. I really need to switch my heating off in a sec, guys, as well. So what I'll do, it's incredible strength to move it. Yeah, what I will do, guys, I just need to go and switch my heating off because I've had it on the last couple of hours. I'm not even feeling the benefit. Um, the thermo starts. Um, the thermos that's like automatically I don't know when it hits certain times I think they're on timers and stuff it changes all the temperatures and I'm not I'm absolutely not feeling it so uh, I think it's playing up and yeah I need to pee anyway so I've got like the weakest bladder and I'm having my G fuel so um, yeah I'll be back in just two seconds guys alright I be, will be as quick as I can two seconds guys
that way, guys. Oh, I've got to even pause the game. Unfortunately, that's clocking up our, our playtime, damn it. Oh, yeah, sorry, guys. I had to totally switch my heating off. Uh, I don't want to touch anything on my computer screen. Just see how many people we have. Let's have a look. Sweet, we've still got 10 watching. Sweet. <laughs> Thanks so much. Yeah, sorry, Dano uh, GNR88. What's up, man? Sorry um, about that. You just literally tuned in at like the wrong time. <laughs> um, yeah, I just literally had like a two minute break. I've been streaming since 7 o'clock, so 2 hours and 15. Um, yeah, yeah, basically, I put my heating on at the start of it, and I need to switch it off because, my God, my heating bill. I've been in this house six months. I've never like had to pay my own bills or whatever. My God. Makes you think twice about putting the heating on. Who else is the same? Once you get your own place and start a... What an M? Oh! Box is limping. Oh, that was really stupid. Oh. Guys, I don't know if we're going to die, you know. Because, uh... I don't know if we're going to die. Right. I'm going to have to use another thingy, Anna. There we go. That stops us limping. Over time, obviously the poison's getting to us. Stupid me. I was that quick to rush off to switch the heating off <laughs> I didn't pause the game so it stopped it so meanwhile while I've been switching the heating off and I went for a wee Jill's been deteriorating so I do apologize I don't if I watch a stream back you, you'll probably see it over time like it, she's slowly like that and then as I come back hi guys then she's all like like full-on limping wow um so yeah based on oh bollocks I need to um, get rid of some. We've got two. Hang on. We don't have to pick all three. It's fine. Based on what the middle clock's showing, it depends. It's something like. I don't know if it's like the. Amber is. Is that three? Or is it the crystal that's three hours? Amber's one hour. Obsidian's two. Something like that. It depends on what's showing on this middle clock. So, present, we've got 11. I don't know if it's either. Crystal. Crystal is either in the middle or to the right, I think. It's either amber, crystal, obsidian. I don't know if it's either that. Or amber, obsidian and crystal, I think. I'm, I'm totally doing this from memory. I've proper been... Um, it's definitely not the first one, I don't think. Not for, not for like 11 o'clock, because that's quite a late time to be shown on that middle clock. But yeah, it's not the same every time. This is a problem, because different times can be showing on the clock. It's a really weird one, but... Sure, I haven't just seen. If not, I'm going to switch these two. Oh man, I'm just uh, I'm so upset about getting poisoned. That's why I don't show vote. I don't usually. Um, but yeah, James Bevis, that was a comfort break as well. I'm obsidian. Um, I'm hoping to play the whole game, mate. I've got to see how long this part takes me. Hoping to. We made decent progress in a couple of hours. We're at the clock tower, anyway. I think we've done it. Sweet. Yeah, it's got to match all the clock times or something. Sweet. So I'll go put that back. I just I just don't feel uh, good at the minute because... Uh, I don't mean in myself, I mean in the game. Um, this is a real problem, getting poisoned by those spiders. I just don't want to have to like start the game again. Well, I mean, not from that. I mean, we did save before then within the clock tower, but... I really don't want to backtrack, so we're making good progress. Um, I've had to waste, like, obviously another resource. Right. Map, let me see where to go. Uh, so we need to be... Um, right, up the stairs. This way. But yeah, hope you're well, man. Thanks for tuning in. I had a quick look just when I got back on my phone. I think we've got like nine or ten people watching, I think. Um, honestly, it's a result for me. Even if I get one person watching, like, 
it's cool. Honestly, it's absolutely fine. Um, and some people may come back and um, obviously watch this because um, once I finish live streaming, um, it has to go through like the processing, um, and it takes a while as well to. It can upload to YouTube in like standard definition and high definition. Um, so for HD, it does take a bit longer, um, but it will like obviously all upload to the tubes. So um, yeah, so it will be viewable. There we go. We use this. It'll be viewable at a later date, anytime you wanna watch it. Oh my bad, my bad. I need to combine them, don't I? Duh, there we go. Chrono's gear. Beautifully ornamented gadgets. So is this. Are we going to combine them? Any of you guys who've um, tuned in a bit later, I drink G Fuel. It's really nice. This is an Ari Village um, theme uh, shaker. And I'm actually celebrating having uh, the Nemesis tea flavour. Absolutely lovely. It's so nice. I'm, honestly, I no I've, I've said it before on the stream I, I'm honest about it, no way um, if we die we die that's my attitude I'm going to take a green herb we'll combine it with a red down here if we die we die guys and we just restart from the last save we've not got that much to do it's fine it's absolutely fine we'll do that has that got freeze oh, stop has that got freeze rounds? Freeze rounds, yeah, that's fine. Um, we don't need the grenade rounds. Freeze rounds will be enough with the magnum. Um, I'm just thinking, I think we've got an encounter with Nemi, I think. Um, but yeah, um, I've been drinking G Fuel. It's like an alternative just to energy drinks. It is so easy to drink. Like, it's just so nice. Like, it's really smooth to drink. It's not all like mega fizzy and stuff. And uh, proper diverted away from like monster energy and like gone onto this. So I absolutely love it. Discovered it through uh, one of my favourite channels called Residents of Evil. Um, but yeah, like you say, it's just in case you guys wonder what I'm drinking. Um, it's pretty much the same price as well. Here we go, guys. That is it. Complete the game. You saved. Down here! Get your popcorn now. It's finally over. Huh? No! There's a bit of Japanese text there. Uh, no. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right, do we use the magma or the freeze rounds? Nemi don't like freeze rounds. Stars. I reckon <laughs> he should chill. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Oh, he's poisoned us anyway. That's fine. That's fine. I mean, we were already poisoned. I appreciate you. That's fine. So we're actually... Guys, we're actually not even at a more of a disadvantage. Virus. See, still poison. We're actually not at a disadvantage as we would normally be. Right. I'm not going to try and get a shot off. Oh, shit. Shit, shit. That was stupid. That was stupid. Oh, shit. He's put us on thingy already. Fuck. <laughs> Bit of a glitchy weather. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. I'm gonna float him with some freeze rounds. A couple of cheap shots on Nemi. Oh. <laughs> Look at that, that's brilliant. Nice. We did it, guys. That went better than I thought. And that's fine, I think. We've got Carlos's part now, I think. So that's such a relief, man. I honestly thought I'd screwed us all. Once I got poisoned by the spiders, um, Dano, you weren't here, but I was showboating with the Magnum. Because just earlier up in the comments, it's not even that far up anyway. Um, yeah, Bane, he was like, shame not to use the Magnum now. <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah, actually, I will do. Showboating. Magnum in the, the spiders on the scene, and then he just pissed some poison on me. Jill! Is our action hero, Carlos? What have I done? I'm sorry, Jill. Please wake up, guys. This is so fun the streaming. I can't tell you. Jill, honestly. Jill. October first, night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I can't believe I'm still alive. 
<laughs> Neither can I. <laughs> I've put us in a pretty bad position. You chill, Jill. Uh, uh, uh. Carlos? It looks like our roles have been reversed from when we originally met, huh? Don't worry, Jill. This chapel is safe. I've been infected by the virus, haven't I? Hey! Take it easy. I'm okay. Don't feel any pain. But that's what bothers me. If I can't feel anything, then what does that mean? Don't give up, Jill. I'll take care of you. Whatever you do, don't let that virus beat you. Such a sweetheart. He's, he's even, like, more polite uh, in the remake. If I turn into a zombie... You won't. Don't hesitate. I want your word that you'll kill me. <laughs> he didn't even say anything either. Yeah, looking back at the chat, um, yeah, obviously when Dana joined, uh, yeah, sorry man, that it was a bit confusing. Like, I did think, obviously, I was only gone for like a couple of minutes, but um, I, put, I put this in the box. Yeah, I was only gone for like a couple of minutes. I was just um, sorting out, I had to switch the heating off. Um, so it's been on for a bit. And my, my last heating bill was insane. Um, Usually I hardly pay like I pay like next to nothing and yeah I was like I need to switch it off. Uh, so yeah, in in the future I think I'll probably like nip on my phone. I'll just type in the chat as myself and just put you know, be back in like two minutes. Just to let people know. Cause, yeah, I did think obviously one one time was too hard. I thought it'd be a bit misleading if anyone joined. I thought oh, I'd be fine. But, yeah, sorry it was a bit misleading. Uh, but yeah, anyway Dano, um do I watch Bot Pursuit? Hell yeah. Bot Pursuit is where it's at. He is amazing, mate. He's so good. Yeah, I was actually watching a bit earlier. What was he playing? Oh, his, his latest upload. Um, it was like a, a Resi 2 NPC uh, randomizer. Oh, shit. Is that you? Look at that. Right up close. We're taking no bites. Ain't no one having a bite of Carl's biceps. Hell not. Um, but yeah, Bot Pursuit is... His skills on Resi are incredible. He's a Canadian, um, yeah, YouTube streamer. He's brilliant. So yeah, definitely check him out. Who Dano's mentioned in the chat, if you like your Resi stuff. He's great. Um, oh, were they there the whole time, then Blue Herbs? I'll have to bear it in mind for next time. Were, were they under our nose the whole time? Because surely they've not just appeared for Carlos. Damn. Hell yeah. Hi, Kev. Thanks for tuning in, man. Streamers looking crispy. That is good to know. Thanks so much. I've been streaming since 7 o'clock, two and a half hours on. No one said anything, so I thought we must be fine. <laughs> Operation Instruction. Order from the UBCS Echo Team. I'll just read this out. Wipe out the downtown area of the infestation and then evacuate the remaining citizens to the clock tower. Among the civilians, remember to give priority to the employees of Umbrella's affiliates. Remember to stay alert because the infected have a high endurance rate and will strike without hesitation. Evacuation procedure. Once the mission is complete or when it becomes impossible to accomplish, evacuate immediately. Two, we'll deploy a helicopter that is waiting in the suburbs to the yard in front of the clock tower. Three, when you're ready for ex ex evacuation, ring the bell of the clock tower to signal the helicopter. Oh, cheers, Kev. 65 inch screen looks perfect. Thanks so much. That's awesome. It. Uh, yeah, um, I actually, I hate watching my own videos and I, I, I hate my voice. I, I sound like, I sound like a, a, an excited 10 year old, especially when I'm gaming and, and streaming, whatever. Um, I, I sound like a 10 year old at a kid's party. The one that's had too much cherry aid. Uh, yeah, I, I hate watching my videos back. But um, yeah, it's awesome to know, man. I will be checking, that sounds so vain, checking out my own s stream. I'll be like having a look, uh, see how it looks on my telly downstairs, and I've got a 60 inch telly downstairs. So yeah, to know it looks cool on your 65 inch, thanks Kev, that's brilliant. Um, and yeah, like I said, this is a really crisp version of uh, RE3, the original. Uh, which way are we going? If we can, we'll look for this one, I think. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I can't stand watching my own video. I love recording them. I hate watching them back. This is where I got poisoned as Jill for anyone who joined a bit late. 
a little bit up. Like you say, I was talking with Bane about the uh, Magnum. I had so many bullets. I got so many gunpowder seeds. And then I uh, I was showboating with the Magnum. And then a spider pissed poison on me. And then I didn't see all them blue herbs in the uh, the hall either. Oh, I solved the clock tower puzzle. So that that's my massive relief for the night. I had a sleepless night last night just thinking about it. I'm kidding. See, if we could not move this as Jill, it said it would take incredible strength. Carlos' biceps are here. Everyone, relax. He's got this. Um, nice. I'm loving the, ser the Series X Retro Arch at the minute. PS2 in 4K on Xbox is great. What's the Retro Arch, Kev? I actually don't know what that is. What we'll do. I don't really want to go... Actually... I wanted to try and keep close to it, but the, then I thought, no, with me, I'll blow myself up. I'm just going to use up some of these. I wanted to see how it is. Um, I thought the rate of fire would be up with it. What is it? Sig Pro SP2009. It's mainly made of plastic and it's very light. It uses 9mm parallel. Now. Yeah, I was curious to see the description of the Merc's handgun. But yeah, um, <clears throat> I'm intrigued, Kev. What is that? Retro Arch. Yes, Dano, I played the remake. I actually completed it the other night um, for the second or third time or something. I think apparently that's a lot. Um, yeah, I love the remake of Resi 3. It's just a shame, as everyone will agree, it's just too short. There's no um, there's no clock tower segment. What we've just been through, like, it's iconic. Um, I just think it's a shame. I think maybe there was a bit um, of oh, the hospital... I love the hospital part. I love the, the parts playing as Carlos. I adore them, honestly, um, on this and the remake. I, I love the remake where you're going through the um, RPD as Carlos as well, with Tyrell. Oh man, these are deadly. Should have made a save. It's fine. Carlos? You're scaring the shit out of me! Oh my god! Yeah! Jeez! That scared the shit out of me then! I don't think he took any damage either. He, he did that pretty well. He took it in stride. Yeah. Um, could I either save it or brave it? We've braved it. Oh, right. Let's check out brave. Um, Kev, emulation from 10. Play Retro PS1. PS2 Dreamcast, PS4, it's at 4K. That's incredible, Kev. You need to tell me how to set that up, man. <laughs> I need to I need to know. We're pretty spoiled with our um, first aids, but I'll, I'll just take one. What is that? Something raccoon? Spicy raccoon? Icy raccoon? No. I was wondering what that was. I swear. Oh, look at them hunters. They're twitching. They are dead dead they've got the blood round, but they're twitching. That sounds awesome, Kev. You have to let me know how you like set that up, whether it's like easy or something. That's cool. Um, <clears throat> nothing strange about it. Dada, remake is good, but yeah, no, Clock Tower and the ending was white. Yeah. I know, man. It, it's just a shame. I think it, like I say, it just had so much more potential. Pop, some, pop the red one in the box. Um, I am playing, it's either the light or heavy version of this. Because I think you either have like easy or hard mode, don't you, on our UK version. But this is the... Right, I'm going to make a save anyway. Um, it's only like the third save I've done all night. Sort of thing. Um, but yeah, for, for tonight, I've done the light mode. It's just so I can kind of, um, you know, it's the first time I'm streaming stuff, so I'm just chilling. Do you know what I mean? Just It's just so I can chill and chat to you guys. I'm doing a different save each time, just in case I screw something up so I can just... Yeah. Easy go back to each save. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, such a shame about RE3 Remake, man. I went for it the other night. I think I was only about... I think it was about five hours or something. Not even that, about four and a half, five hours. I don't think there's any real reason to take the blue herb. I've not seen any... Uh, it's like I've been devoured from the inside out. Yeah, there's no spiders anywhere, no spiders, is there? I'll take them. Might as well. 
Um, so yeah, that is why, guys, we're getting a bit spoiled. What's that? It says 6 p.m. We'll have a party at Bar Jack. Bar Jack, isn't that the um? That's where we saw Brad, isn't it? In the bar. Sure it is. Tape recorder. As I said, my mind is foggy towards the end of this game. A patient's diagnosis recorded onto here. Right. Cool pizza. What does that say? I love exploring anything. Unfinished coffee? Is there even a, a thing as unfinished coffee? Tom Maguire, hey host, what was Wayne really like in person? Oh man, yeah. Um <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. So, you know, I was on his, his show years ago. So, yeah, um, for anyone who don't know, back in uh, 2010, I was on Wayne Rooney's show Street Striker on Sky 1. Voice recognition log, okay. Please enter your voice. So that'll have to be, obviously, from the, the doc on the diagnosis. There also appears to be a slight fracture in his right arm just below the elbow. However... <laughs> nice. Technology. Um... But yeah, uh, Rooney in person. He's like, it's really funny because he, he's like, um, which one are we even on? Go fourth floor? I don't know which one to go first. I can't even remember the ending of this game. Like, remember, you know, smoothly what to do. We picked the wrong floor. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, Rooney. Um, obviously, meeting him, I was like really starstruck. Completely starstruck. It's unreal. Because um, you remember back then. Well, actually, it was just after he was absolutely, you know, in some of his best form. Um, so, obviously, when I met him, it was just after the World Cup. Like, obviously, when, you know, the performance by by him already it wasn't too, um, you know, it's pretty underwhelming. Um, but no, he was still, like, one of the best footballers around. Oh shit. I don't remember any of these. We've got to get these guys because otherwise they can really mess you up, them little ones. But yeah, he's quite shy in person, honestly. So what I was saying, I was massively starstruck because he's one of the best full footballers in the world at the time. Back in 2010. Numbers 104 printed on the slip. Right, we'll have to remember that. Re remind me to remember that number, 104. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, so we were all starched up, but Rooney was actually more, he seemed more nervous of us than we were of him, if that makes sense. He's very shy in person, but he will chat to you. You just got to make a bit of conversation, really. He's like, you're right. <laughs> you know, uh, some of the teams have been placed here. Oh, I get it, I get it. I think, do we have to move? There is like that, isn't there, but I'm thinking, do we have to put that over one of the vents? But there's nothing to move there. That looks so South Park, doesn't it? The poster above him. Right, remember 104. I don't know if there's anything else in here. Dano, do you think South's best in the world? I reckon so, right now, yeah. Um, I think the best footballer in the world, it, it has been for years, like Ronaldo, I, I do think. Um, yeah, obviously I know that there's always the, been the whole thing, you know, Ronaldo v Messi and stuff, but um, yeah, I just think Ronaldo is incredible, his, his mentality, that's what separates him, he, he dedicates his life, literally, doesn't he, just to make sure he's at it his optimum peak, he's, he's unreal. Nikolai, you're still alive? Like 36 years old or something. So what happened? What's going on? He's so quick to kill people, Nikolai, he doesn't mess around. I'm one of the supervisors. That's all you need to know. Wait! Oh shit! Fuck. His body's still intact. <laughs> I can't believe you can't, like, examine anything on here. It's crazy. I'll take some more bullets, might as well. They're there, aren't they? But I, I get way carried away. I, I love using the assault rifle. It's incredible. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to try complete this in one go tonight, guys, if I can. Sick room key. Photo D. The zombies are walking. <laughs> so it's the effect of the T virus on the laxative. 
fucking storm on him. I love the hospital part. Like I, I don't remember much of it. Um, it's just been oh, it's just been so long. Um, but yeah, I love medical stuff. It's great. The hospital section and the uh, check and the uh, what do you call it? The RPD section of the remake. Unreal. Four hundred two. Yeah, I love Carlos's parts. I, I I just adore the assault rifle. It's so good, and that's like another reason why I played this on light mode. Because I know you get it all handed to you on a plate, literally, don't you? Um, it's very generous. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, which one do we? Something seems to have been placed here. It says that about all of them, though. Hmm. I'm not sure, guys. It's probably going to be a bit of a trial and error. Does it depend on what? Let me just check that other room, Max. I don't know if it depends on where it's placed in that other room, you know. Tom Guy, have you worked at Young's before? It's always like that. Yeah, if you're from my hometown, you've most likely worked at Young's. I have, mate, yeah. Um... Uh, it's alright, it's just money. It's factory work and it's money, that's all I can say. Right, so that's placed in the... I'm trying to kind of get my bearings right, okay. Just thinking which um, bit this should be placed at. Otherwise it's going to be a bit of a trial and error thing. So that should be based on that other room. That was based on... Oh, hang on, hang on. The poster's there. It will either be this corner or the other. Right, bear with me. Um, yeah. Um. Oh no. Yeah, for people who don't know what Young says, it's basically working with seafood. I don't think it's the opposite, you know, because I don't know if. Uh... Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, let's get out. I think the poster it's on the same side is it on the same side as the poster so it should be the other corner i think because it it's kind of too obvious over here isn't it it's gonna be one of these corners it's too close really do it in the other one do i prefer this over the second game no dano uh the original re2 is my favorite not even just resi it's my favorite video game of all time it's absolutely incredible um there's just something about it. I think I first played these games, um, one, two, and three, the originals. Please be right. Nice. Sweet. I if that's 104 on the safe, because we got given that thing, didn't we? Hell yeah. Is that it? Nice. Um, yeah, I first played these games when I was like in year three or four, so I would have been about seven or eight years old. I'm sure I played the second one first. Will you take the vaccine base? Sweet. And I was just absolutely fascinated with uh, Leon and Claire, especially Leon. Um, I, I don't know what it is about him. Paul Haddad, honestly, rest in peace, the, the guy. He was absolutely incredible. Yeah, we've been in there. So we're finished on this floor. Um, yeah. He absolutely, I don't think, um, he passed away unfortunately in, uh, yeah, I think it was 2020, um, so incredibly sad, um, yeah, I, I just don't think he, I don't know if he realised, like, how special he made the character, honestly, these people who voiced them, like, we grew up with them, do you know what I mean, like, these, these voice actors, they don't realise, especially at the time, and they wouldn't have been paid very much either back in the 90s. They wouldn't have been, I wouldn't imagine. Oh, shit! That woke me up. Um, yeah. We grew up with these and we actually looked up to them. Do you know what I mean? It's like watching your favourite, like, superhero film or movie, but in a game. We looked up to these characters. They were unreal. Oh, shit. Don't mess around. Awful, man. They, they really shit me up, the hunters, because obviously one swipe, behead you, and then that's it. You're gone. 
Electronic collector saying hi to Kev. Loads of people know Kev, he's a legend. I've got enough health, I can't stash anymore. We're spoiled already. Complicated locks and cannot be opened, all right. The medium base. I don't know if we actually combine these or do we put them in a machine? Mm. Yeah, I can't remember at all. Oh, I am chilly. I know that I'm cold. I have to take a break to go switch the heat off. I know that I'm cold. I'm sat here in a Fred Perry shirt. But I'm dressed for the occasion because it's the first stream ever on my channel. <laughs> medical instruction manual. Uh, Umbrella Medical Service, North America Division, Douglas Rover. In order to activate the synthesizer to cultivate the vaccine, please follow the procedure as detailed below. This is the answer we need. Supply enough energy to the system, set the medium base to the device, which we have. When the device is ready, you can start mixing the vaccine medium. To mix the vaccine, you need to control the five levers. These will cause the two gauges or gouges gauges to increase or decrease. If you adjust the two gauges so that they stop at the centre, the vaccine medium will then be produced automatically. Right, so we've got to put in the medium base and get them. That's definitely going to jump out as well, isn't it? Um. <clears throat> oh, thanks, man. Retronic Collector. Yeah, he's a YouTube legend on the tube. Yeah, honestly, well known for his car boot videos and that. Unreal. They, they've racked up some views, the, the car boot videos. And drop your like down below. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. It just helps the video, you know. It can just help get us some, you know, new viewers and that. It's, it's always good to bring new people in. I've uh, so, seen loads of, like, um, you know, names that I've seen before comment on my videos and stuff. I, I really appreciate it. Um, so yeah, I know lots of people in the chat. Really nice people to be tuning in. I have absolutely not a scooby-doo what we're doing on this. Okay. I don't know what everything is on here. Right, so that makes that go down. <laughs> Does that go down, that go up. Mm. Oh. See what these below do. It's gonna to totally be a trial and everything, this guys. I don't remember this whatsoever. Oh, almost. What does B do? Hmm. I wonder if. Want there a switch that puts the the second one up, the other one down? That's what we need. Oh, <laughs> we totally drained it. My bad. Let's redo. Oh, guys, we're almost there. If any of these from below can sort something. Hmm. Try B. Oh, guys, we might be a bit stuck on this for a bit. I have a, not a Scooby. I don't have a clue. Hmm. Again. That'll put that up and the other one down though, won't it? Let's try below. Oh, this is a pain. Let's try one, because that cranks the first one up. Oh, we're going to be here all night. I have no idea, man. Oh, we've almost got it. I wonder if any of the below ones can do it. No, that ain't gonna do it. 
no way. We'll do that again to undo what we just did. Tag B. Almost. I'm just not making head and tail of what it's doing, do you know what I mean? Then below again. Right, so one makes that go down, the second one go up. Two makes that go up, that go down. So, try that. No, I've done the wrong one. Hang on. I'll do what I just did. Try the second one. Oh. Apologies, guys. This is absolute trial and error. Right, let me see what I just did. Right. Try B. Got that right, but we just done. Oh, finally did. I didn't know how long that was going to take. You just eventually get there with these puzzles. Like some of them, there's just, you know what I mean. It's like some of them I just have no answer for. You just do it. Right, and this is where. Right, so we got this. Vaccine base. Sweet. Combine it. And we have actually got back vaccine. So back to Jill now. Let's go. How have they not broke? <laughs> Don't too soon. I've run right past it. You fucker. He was in the way. You put me off. Is it in some kind of sequence thing that looks to me? Uh, yeah, it was it was in a kind of sequence one. I had to like I was trying to figure out um, yeah, which levers to, the three levers and then the two, letter A and B underneath, I was just like, one of them would make, you know, the first one go up, the second one down, and then vice versa. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, no. <laughs> the door won't close. Give me a sec. Just give me a sec. Wow, okay. I said the chat, but it's all fine. We're gonna have to take, take out the other one. We've got a close with his mouth there. It'll close now with the corpses in. That was great. <laughs> a live one. It won't close. Right, we've been to the fourth floor. We completed that first floor. Back to Jill. We put together a vaccine, guys. Map. Okay, so we need to be to the left. Oh. Oh. My god, they're diving about everywhere. As if they just got a couple of cheeky shots at Carlos's booty just then. Damn it! Right. Now we'll take back to Jill, then we'll save. I've kept doing that. To close the map, I have to press square or X on this controller. And rarely I need to be... I was pressing the other one. Pressing that. <gasps> Shit. A timer-based bomb. Just give me a sec, because I don't... Oh my god. Do I just need to run out? Sorry guys, I'm shitting myself, because I don't... I forgot about that. Oh, it's fine. As, as long as I don't need to do anything else, I hate being on time with it. I've not saved it in a little bit. I thought, no, I'll wait till we're back as Jill, then I'll give it safe. <sighs> forgot about that. Carlos, our action hero. 
Check the map again. Um, yeah. Nothing else out here, I don't think. There's nothing to unlock the doors. It's just the vaccine and back to jail, isn't it? Let's go. Showboating. No showboating. We all know what happened last time. I got Jill poisoned. <laughs> In the clock tower. I need to keep checking where the hell I'm... Uh, so I want to be... I do it every time I press the wrong thing to close the map. Up here. Upstairs to the top of the clock tower. Where Jill... Oh. Right. Right. How oh, else do I get up there? Confusing me. I'm not going to get anywhere that way. Let me go back through. With that closed off, yeah, we need to get up to Jill. We've got the vaccine. No, it's not. I wanted to came through that one. I don't like all that noise, it makes me feel uneasy. Ugh. Oh. It's gotta be back from here. Told you my mind's foggy later on in the game. Oh shit! <laughs> Let me just use up some of these. Playing dead. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Gotta have this a quick because I'm going to the unknown. So I don't know where I'm going. Um We can't be far off it. We cannot be far off. Right, so back through here. Right, we came through. Sorry, I have to keep checking, guys. I'm losing my bearings. We came through there. That time thing, didn't we? With the time key. Unless we go and check again and see if we can unlock any of those doors on the way back. But they were both shown as locked on the map. You what? Watch me get us poisoned for no fucking reason. <laughs> Dano, am I planning on playing other games like a little Silent Hill fight? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I'm planning like loads more live streams. Absolutely, like loads more um, Resi games. Um, yeah, all the other Resi games, um, retro to modern. And yeah, Silent Hill is definitely on the list. Um, I'm not, I'm not the best on the first Silent Hill though. Yeah, I've got to think about where we're going now. It's fine, Jill. It's just threw me with the uh, upstairs being blocked off. Um, but yeah, I'd love to do the Silent Hill series. It's just been, I have not completed the first Silent Hill in literally years. Um, I was doing a play for a while ago, but it was like, it was like before I moved house every time, over six months, I'm like way deep into the game. Um, I don't know if I'm maybe at halfway or just over halfway or something. Um, but I needed to refer to a guide at a few parts. Like I wasn't sure about some parts. I totally needed to uh, refresh my memory on those. Um, not easy. Oh, that's all I needed to do, just trigger a cutscene. <laughs> but yeah, I kind of need to... Oh, shit. Don't say we've got to fight him. Nah. Surely we, we don't have to. Um, yeah, I need to get good at the first one. Um, I've only played bits of the second one. I've not played the others. I've got three and four. I've just not got onto them yet, so... Is Jill through here? Oh, she is as well, isn't she? You ain't coming in, Nemi. It's gonna be all romantic and shit with Carlos and Jill. 
we administer that vaccine? Oh, hell yeah! Here we go. Mm -hmm. Hey! Are you okay? Yes. You best yeah. be. What's going on? No spent a long way. time putting that vaccine that together. just doesn't give up. What? I thought we killed that thing. No, it's been waiting for you. <laughs> you're in, de you're in demand, Jill. Carlos, do you think that it's unstoppable? No, I don't think so. I'm sorry, Jill, but I've got to go take care of a few things. Oh, and bad news. Nikolai is still alive. Nikolai? Are you sure? Yes. He got blown out the window, I didn't I don't he? know how, but I do know that he is our enemy. Remember, don't trust him. <clears throat> all right, now we do a save. We are absolutely doing a save. Right, we're all fully healed, thank God. Okay. She was nearly a Jill sandwich, absolutely. The vaccine saved her. <laughs> right, freeze rounds for Nevi. Loads of magnets, that's all we need. A bit more health will do. Is that all we've got? Wow, we need a bit more. I'm not liking the health situation, guys. We're going to have to find some more. Uh, but yeah, Dano, like, there's, there's loads of other games, man, that I want to play. Um, I'm just going to make a save here, because uh, I'm not liking how much the lack of health we've got. It's my fault as well. I've, I've passed up on picking up a few bits. I didn't want to pamper us too much, you see. I've, I've made it... Made us a bit deprived at this point in the game. Um, but yeah, um, I recently uploaded a recording of Stray Souls, um, a game I saw on Steam, uh, which is an upcoming psychological horror. Um, there's a lot of I want to do, man. I want to do like the, um, I want to do like the Dead Space series, uh, as you say, that like Silent Hill series. I just need to work out where on earth I'm going. I don't get what's going on. Um, <laughs> we're just going out the, the main door. Um, but yeah, there's loads, man. Shit. Um, oh, there's also a game I've bought and downloaded from Steam called Alyssa. And it's it looks like a PS1 game. Um, sorry, guys. I have to keep referring to the maps. I don't get what's going on at all. Um, I just don't... I don't know where to actually go. I assume... Do we just try and leg it out that way? Give it a go, if not, it'll be the other door. Um, yeah, and it's basically, it looks just like a PS1 game, really nostalgic, survival horror. You're basically kind of captured and put into this, it's a mansion, uh, but there's like, you, yeah, you're basically like a, turned into a doll and uh, put into this mansion. There's like other dolls, other creatures, it's really trippy, it's really cool, basically. Um, yeah, I saw it on uh, a channel that I watched. I thought, oh, I really fancy uh, streaming that. So, yeah, uh, that's definitely on the list. Um, but, yeah, at the minute, I thought I'll, I'll just kick it off with some Resident Evil. Um, obviously, uh, Resident Evil 2, the original, is my favourite Resi and game of all time. But, um, yeah, I've already done a playthrough of it on my channel. It was about six months ago. Um, so I thought, I don't want to kind of repeat it. I thought, I'll do something different. I'll do uh, Resident Evil 3. Um, I'd love to like, just refresh my memory on this game and I just find it so fun. As scary as Nemi is and intimidating. Uh, yeah. So yeah, I thought I'd kick it off with RE3. Um, yeah. I might maybe do Resi 2 next, possibly. I know I know it's a bit backwards. I was saying to my mate, like, um, I could have done maybe the original Resi 1, then 2, then 3. And I'm kind of working backwards, but it's because if I did RE1, I'm not the best on it. We need the lock pick. No, 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 no. Okay. We could load it, but... <laughs> Shall we just load it? I, d I definitely saved it, didn't I? I'm sure I definitely saved it, but we'll just run back anyway. It's fine. There's a, there's a box like two seconds away. Um, we just need to hopefully not take any damage from Nemi. Um... But yeah, I just have to concentrate to it. I just needed a nice chill stream tonight. I say chill. <laughs> Nemesis running riot. Um, yeah, knife only run next. Hell nah. Hell nah, man. What do you think I am? <laughs> Absolutely not. 
I, you know what? I have actually done a knife only. It was on like an easier mode, but I've done knife only on the Resident Evil One remake. Um, yeah, I've actually done that. I, I did it for the achievement. I thought I'll give it a go. I actually did it as well. Can't believe it. Awesome. Awesomeness. Let's go. Um, yeah, I actually did it. So yeah, that was fun. Um, ben Jones, we'll be doing car boot sales again soon. I oh, know, yeah, thanks, man. I've had like actually a few people ask. It is this door, isn't it? <laughs> no, it's the other door. Ask keep. Oh, let's keep checking. It's that one, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I've had, a, I've had a few people ask to join the stream tonight. Um, if I'll be doing some more car boot videos. I will do once the car boot starts up again. Uh, the, it usually starts up in March, my local one. Um, and then again the the big issue is it's like getting the footage together as well i need footage i need video games or video game related pickups merch um yeah so I, I need to make the pickups to get the footage together and it is difficult um because there's everyone else is just looking for the same thing man um yeah it's a difficult one there's so much competition it, like i said earlier it's a very uh, competitive hobby the zombies are attacking but you still had a chance to take a photo I love it. I love that 90s mentality. Um, yeah, we'll take all these. We might as well. But yeah, we'll we'll, uh, we'll stash them away in here though, because uh, I just don't get. I've got six freeze rounds for Nemi. Nemi hates freeze rounds. I've said that uh, earlier tonight. Um, but yeah, Kaboos will be returning. Um, but it. It just might take some time to get some uh, episodes together. Do you know what I mean? I, like those videos that they've done the best on my channel, even like better than all my gameplay ones. But yeah, um, I will try get some uh, game content put together for you guys. Uh, not only car boots, but also go into like stores and stuff. I'd love to go to some uh, retro game stores when I've got some spare money. You know, just to treat myself to some games. Um, my main priority uh, with my game collecting i'm i'm really uh i'm really prioritizing getting horror games they've gone up loads in value they really have like horror has gone up loads oh okay oh what's going on i'm trying to get my map up that's it <laughs> couldn't even get my map mm. i don't know which way You've got to kill these, they're an absolute pain. Oh, come on. Oh, no. There can't be any more of you guys. There we go. <laughs> um, what was my thoughts on the RE Village? Absolutely amazing. I loved it, honestly. Um, better than uh, Resident Evil 7, I reckon. Um, it's weird, because when I played RE 7, I was like... It just doesn't quite feel like Resident Evil. Um, did they come from that way? I'm just double checking, guys. Just, yeah, we did come up. Right. What I'm gonna do? Stop. I'll go that way first, and then we'll go down those stairs. I don't know which way to go first. It's sport for choice. Um, yeah, Ari Village. I genuinely think they nailed the horror. Um, shape of the fountain changes based on the combination of the gears. Mm. Does that mean it's off? I don't have to take a picture of it so I can have a look. Give me a sec. Say cheese, guys. <laughs> Let me just take a picture. I haven't got photographic memory. But I think, do we need to go for the top one? To switch the... Uh... Oh, actually, or do we need to be in the middle of the fountain? Okay. That's what it's on at the minute. I just want to see what's what. Right, so we need to drain the water, don't we? Okay. Mm. What should we do? Should we do... Right. Um, yeah, they, they nailed the whole in village. Lady Dimitrescu. 
and all the uh, the creepy girls that are absolutely awesome character they really are. Well, that that combination it worked. I did the bottom one. Let's try. Yeah, I wasn't too sure at first. When I saw the first person, I was a bit like, oh. But no, it works. It's great. I think that's the combo I want. Yeah, I was going for the one third one down. I actually did need the third one on my phone, actually, because I've been looking at these. No, it's still not worked. I think we need the other one. It's always like the last combination that I try. Try... Right. I'm going to try the second combination down. Let's try that. Yeah, gl glad you liked uh, Ari Village, man. It was awesome. Mm, yeah, I liked Ari 7, but um, oh, we can actually... I thought we had to drain the water. My bad, my bad. Prefer the illustration to drain the pool. Right. trying to like memorise it. Right, so you need the whites at the bottom and then the blacks at the top. We just basically need to reverse them. Okay. No, we haven't got enough moves. Right, I know what I want to do, but um Village. I'm looking forward to doing a, a play for again of that. Um, yeah, RE7, I've not, I've got to say, I've not felt the absolute motivation to go back to it. I think, I'm sure, I don't know if I've completed it twice, I think I've just completed it for the once. Um, really enjoyed it, but I don't like being chased everything, it does my head in. You know, being chased by Jack and then, then the, the old woman, um, Marguerite. All the creepy family and everything. It was being chased everywhere. It was good though. Um, I did enjoy it, but Ari Village, I think, is miles above uh, seven. They've definitely improved on that. Um, absolutely love the creepy atmosphere. It's so good. Um, oh, thanks, man. Retronic Collector. Thanks. I appreciate it, Tony. I'm glad you enjoy the uh, the channel. I know you've watched my pickups before and stuff. I appreciate that. I don't know if we had a boss coming up. That so I'm proper loaded up with everything. I'm confused. <laughs> Let's explore all the, uh, the graveyard. Mm. Let's try that one first. I just don't want to miss anything. I'm just. Uh, mm. We'll do with the red hair, actually. We'll do that. Yeah, actually, thinking about it, we actually do need to be collecting stuff. As I said, we got a bit of a health sitch. We're not spoiled for choice on our health, are we? <laughs> Same time, I just don't want to take all our inventory space. Um, yeah, absolutely, man. They, they missed the park out the remake. Another part. They, they really cut the RE3 remake short. It's such a shame. Even if they brought out... They could redeem themselves slightly by bringing the clock tower and the park out like as DLCs. <laughs> Redeem of ever society. Um, it's locked. Savage Raccoon Park Cemetery. Oh, what are we going to do then? Um, I've missed a comment somewhere. Um, yeah, Stephen Toes has seen the new Resident Evil movie. I have indeed, man. I went to see it not long after it came out. Um, you know what? I I've said earlier in the stream, I actually liked it. It's um, <laughs> Someone said it sucked. I think it was uh, Falcon Scott when he was in here. Um, yes, I agree. I think it, it does suck in a way, but it's actually not too bad and i've accepted that it's um it's the closest we're gonna get to resident evil uh the games is there nothing else to do around here so just... right so we need to head back so we've at least drained the pool we've made this available but we're gonna have to find that key from somewhere aren't we because that's obviously locked so we need to go back into that other area go down the stairs we didn't go there last time 
But yeah, it's filled with uh, video game references. Um, itchy tasty, all that look. Awesome. Jill sandwich, of course. But yeah, they, uh, they've they insulted a few of the characters a little bit. I think it's uh, a little insulting, but it is what it is. It, they're not, it's not as bad as the poor Anderson movies. They're terrible. <laughs> really bad. I mean, I, I'll watch them. Because me and my mum like them. We, we enjoy watching them and... Um, yeah, Mary Yovovich, she's a cool actress. I like it in the second one, where uh, where they're like in the church and they're uh, she comes like storming in on like a motorbike and like you know kicks all the zombie dogs and stuff like that. Um, oh, we'll make a special herb, shall we? First time we've done that all game. We'll add the blue in there. Sweet mixed herb. We can actually potentially do another one as well. Mm. I'll leave it for now. We're proper uh, pushed for space at the minute. Yeah, um, the Ari movie has not been received very well at all, and I can get, I can understand why completely. It's fine. It it does suck in a way, but like I say, I've accepted that's the closest we're gonna get to the games on film. But it's still good. I I enjoyed it, and it comes out on the you know like DVD Blu-ray on. February the 7th, so I will be getting on Blu-ray for sure. I'm really looking forward to giving it another watch, I actually am. I'm trying to conserve this ammo, because... Mm. See, we get given this, don't we, at the start of the game, but I've not seen ammo for it all through the game. I don't think we have had any ammo for it. Proper made this have to last throughout the game. Oh, damn. We've got enough. Got enough, might as well blow them apart with the magnum. I can still have footsteps. Poor prints. Poor steps. No, she aimed at the barrel. When you want to aim at the barrel, she aims at the enemies. Away from the barrel. When you want to aim at the enemies and you don't there's a barrel there, she aims at the barrel. Damn it! I actually didn't know. Got on a right cinematic there, eh? we? The park king. Sweet. Okay. Written order to the supervisors. Mission requirements, Bravo 16. One, obtain a secure sample of all the information pertaining to this case. Observe and record combat data on the UBCS. Two, destroy all evidence including the medical facility that has the medical treatment data. Three, check the guinea pig's ability to accomplish the mission. Once your mission is complete, evacuate the area. Remember that you must not help anyone who is not a supervisor, nor bring anything back that might be traced to where it belongs. The new Matrix movie? No, Tony, I've not seen that yet. I won't mind watching it though. I, I definitely need a rewatch of the old ones. 100%. Oh, is that to open this one? Nice. It's not missing out on Magnum Bullets. Um, yeah, I've, I've seen all the others, but that, that was years ago. Um, is this the right key? Let me just double check. Part key. Or is this for the other one? Right, it's definitely not working. Before we run back, so I'm going to have to run back. Right. So this is for the other gate. Okay. That's fine. Uh, but yeah, I won't mind a, a rewatch of at least the first movie before I go back and see this one. Um, what did you think to the new Matrix movie? Is it decent? I think it's like good and bad. Uh, overall, you know, like from friends and online and stuff. It seems to kind of have mixed reviews at the moment. But yeah, I remember uh, the games were good, man. Enter the Matrix was cool. I enjoyed that. Mm, where do we need to be? How do I get back up there? I think. Oh, I keep doing that every time. I keep pressing the wrong button to close the map and it's bringing up my selection of maps. No. Surely we don't need to be back there. Yeah. That's right, isn't it? Past the fountain and then that locked gate, I think. But yeah, it'll be interesting to see um, how sales go. <laughs> on uh, DVD and Blu-ray of the uh... 
Where did this go? Let's go. Did this go here? Um, yeah. Of uh, Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City. I can't see it selling very well. However, I will be one of the people purchasing it because I'm a sucker for that. I'm a sucker for Resident Evil. Of course I'm going to buy it. There's two that suits in the back. I want to get up here. These damn eels. They're annoying, the, the small things, man. That um, RE2 boss that spits out like them little cockroach things. Like, the little cockroach things are worse than the actual boss when you're trying to fight the boss. And then they're all, they've all got hold of you. It's a shame I can't actually pick that up. I can't combine it straight away. That's the beauty of like the, the remakes. Like if you um if you inventory is full like that, you can still approach like a herb and then it'll let you combine it like with the green. But obviously on these old ones, you need to actually pick it up. You need the inventory slot for it to be able to combine them. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, nice. Discarded it. Sweet. I get that now. You might as well just enhance the, the health. <laughs> um, yeah, after you've defeated like bosses like that, like the RE2 on that spits out the cockroaches, you're left with all the cockroaches afterwards and they can potentially even kill you. As I've found, they've put me on danger before. They're absolutely deadly, man. Nice. Okay. Is there a box? Oh, it's a bo oh, nice. Nice. Save room through there. Okay. That's my. Oh, stop. Every time. Every time. Doing that to the map. Okay. So, what have we got here? Main six tools are placed here. The iron pipe. Okay. I feel like I don't want to interact with it yet because I don't want anything to happen right now. I need to get to the box. So, I'll just pick up one of these for now because what we'll do, we'll combine them for some more magnum ammo. Um, that's fine. We'll dump these here. Are they readable? No. Oh, nice little first aid spray. That's cool. Right. I don't think we need that. Um, I don't know if we might need the lighter because there, there is a fireplace there, isn't there? I'm sure. Right, we'll put all these back because I want to pick up the... Uh... Right, let's go back through. Pick up them gunpowders and I'll have a look at the... Uh... See if there's that fireplace. James Bevis, Holster, How Do You Rate Parasite Eve 2? That was similar to Resi... Mate, that's on my list of things to play. Which could catch on fire. Wind is blowing from the back of the fireplace. Okay. Also, I'll have to maybe pop the pipe there, then light the fire, I think. Um, yeah, it's on my list of things to play, man. Yeah, I'd love to do some playthroughs then. Definitely will. Um, so, yeah, that's that's another one on my list. Absolutely. Combine them. Let's get them more magnum ammo. Yeah, I've definitely heard good things about the Parasite E game. So you played it? Let me know if anyone's played it, what they're like. I'd be interested to know. Oh, we do have another one. Let's make that triple C gunpowder and combine it with the reloading tool. Probably going like overboard with all this, but um, I'd rather stock us right up. Look at this. Is it 48? 48 magnum ammo. Buzzing. Look at that. Absolutely awesome. Um, yeah. <clears throat> right, we'll put that back in there. Um, oh, that'll slot in our first aid thing as well, won't it? I might make a save as well, because I, I don't know if it, the worm boss is here. I'm not sure. I, I'm going to have to go pee again as well in a sec. Um, I've, I've got, like, the weakest blood, and I've been drinking G Fuel, uh, for those of you who don't know. It's, like, an alternative uh, kind of energy drink. It's, like, one of them with, like, no sugar, but they have, like, sweeteners in, obviously, to make them sweet. Um, yeah, it's just so nice and smooth to drink. Uh, I found it through YouTubers, and there's lots of, like, big YouTubers that have their own, like, flavour and stuff, so, yeah. What I'm gonna do... Uh, nice, I'm glad to have the new Matrix movie was decent. Sweet. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, the, the special effects and the CGI's, I bet it's decent with today's technology. Right, I'm gonna pause it as well, because it's just gonna run up our, um, playtime. And when I was poisoned earlier... I, uh, I did that, I just left it running like that, and then because she was poisoned, Jill deteriorated. By the time I got back, she was on danger and limping. Um, just before I go, I'm, well, I'm literally going like for two minutes. I'm literally just going for a dead quick toilet break, because I've got like the weakest bladder ever. Um, yeah, I'm just going to 
go on it. And I, I just want to put in the chat. Be back in two minutes, guys. Be back in two minutes. It's just if anyone joins, because Dano joined earlier and uh, he was like, what's going on? Because he saw my empty chair. <laughs> he thought I just ditched you guys. Be back in two minutes, guys. G Fuel P Break. Laughing emoji, because I'm so funny. I've done that emoji as well. There we go. It's just so people know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, 10 watching apparently still. Thanks very much. 19 likes, that's awesome. Um, no, honestly, it's awesome to have you guys. It really is. So there we go. Yeah, that's me coming up. Um, yeah, I love Dino Crisis. Um, I love the first one. I've not completed it in years. Um, and I definitely plan to um, play Dino Crisis on this channel. Uh, I've got um, all three games. Um, I've got one and two on PS1. Not tried uh, the second one yet. And I've not actually played the third one yet. I've got that on the OG Xbox. So yeah, um, definitely plan on um, streaming them, recording them for the channel. Um, so yeah, I'll be back in two seconds, guys. All right, I'll just be a sec. Legend is back, so she thinks. Whew. Dano, you forgot to like it. Shit, I forgot to like it. You're up to 20. Thanks, man. Massively appreciate it. That's really nice. Thanks. Thanks, you guys. It just helps the video do a bit better, you know? Whew. I'm freezing. I'm freezing. It's so cold. I had the heating on earlier. Didn't feel much of the benefit. I think while I was playing the game, I have not worked out how to use the thermostat at all. Uh, so at certain times, I think it's timed at different temperatures. So I'll set it like way in the 20s, then it'll go down to like 15 degrees, it'll be freezing. And it'll have changed when I've not noticed. So I think that's what happened while I was streaming. So I was like, fuck this. I'm turning the heating off. So yeah, I switched it off. Um, <laughs> well, I'm freezing now. I might even have to put my um, RPD hoodie on. But um. I'm wearing my Fred Perry shirt because for the occasion, do you know what I mean? It's it's my first time streaming on the channel. My bad. I need the lighter. So I'm guessing we have to. Uh... Jeez, how unfit am I? <laughs> I think it's just the adrenaline. It's the adrenaline because I'm I'm proper enjoying the streaming. Absolutely love it. Oh. Fuck off. 
What? Sorry, my, my Siri's activated on my phone. What happened there? My phone's on Do Not Disturb. Stop. <laughs> Siri just what? had to like butt in. Even if I said your name, you're on Do Not Disturb. What happened there? Weird. <laughs> right then, what are we doing with this? What, the iron pipes? Right. Are we lighting that first? Okay. Do we poke the iron pipe up there or something? No longer need the light and discard, that's fine. The light can be seen from the back of the fireplace. Okay. Light the wood. Poke with the stick. Yes, yeah, science, bitch. Um, I'm a bit nervous. I don't know whether to get another... Uh, my instinct is saying get another health thing. Hmm. I don't know if we're at a boss or not. We saved it anyway, so... I'm just going to take one more thingy. Where is it? Where is it? Let's set the mix. Uh, we'll save that for the end, end boss. Just got to save the gold one. Got to go spam down ballet for the final boss. You are gold! Yeah, I'm feeling uneasy. Oh, I'm feeling... Is, is this going to lead that to boss? I've never guess guess this was your first time like the first time at live stream. You're a natural man. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. Um, I uh, oh, I've got quite a few things. I don't want to clog up the inventory space. Mm. Take the park key. Okay. I just can't remember when this boss is gonna come up, so I didn't unequip things. Facts from the HQ. Attention, the Raccoon City project has been abandoned. Our political manoeuvring in the Senate, Senate, to delay their plans and are futile. All supervisors should evacuate immediately. The US Army is going to execute their plan tomorrow morning. The city will be obliterated at daybreak for sure. Yeah, I'm used to recording um, lots, but I'm just not used to streaming, mate. <laughs> Supervisors report the endurance ability of the contaminated guinea pigs is truly incredible. Even when shot in a vital area, they can sometimes survive for several days without taking care of the wound. However, after prolonged exposure to the virus, the guinea pig's intelligence level decreases to that of an insect. Even though reviving the dead seems too disgusting, the virus may still be of use. If we inject the virus into our POWs and release them, they would return to their units and then turn into zombies. This plan may work well for us in the future. In certain areas, the virus seems to have caused the mutation of animals and plants. It may be difficult, but it'll make a good sample for the bioweapon development. I've heard that there is a giant alligator, but I have only encountered a giant creature moving underground. That's what I'm talking about. I don't even want to imagine what creature spawned that monster. Probably come out of Nemesis S. I encountered Nemesis. If I didn't know about it, I'd have been contaminated and would have become one of them by now. If you're still walking around the city, its mission is not yet over. Stars members must be very tough since they have survived until this point. Yeah, it's talking about us, guys. However, they cannot hold out forever. Yeah, we can. Challenge accepted. Bitch. <laughs> Set to the auto-receive mode. Right, so there's nothing we can do. Oh, I'm really freezing. I need to get my RPD hoodie, I think. Mm. Right, we've got the park key, so we're going now, aren't we? Park life. Oh. All supervisors, mission terminated. Return immediately. Repeat. All supervisors return immediately. Over. Uh -oh. can, we, can we do a reply to that? How about no? Nah. Right, I'm gonna nip and get my RPD hoodie. It's I'm quite only impressed you've managed to stay alive up until now. Clearly my warmth doesn't matter and if someone wants me. And you seem to be me. doing a pretty good job of looking out for yourself. How about helping out? I have no intention of helping you. Because we're nothing but pawns in all this? In a manner of speaking, you are. 
Our employers wanted oh a detailed God, analysis of the zombie beings which were created through infection by the T-Virus. You're saying that they deliberately sent in a military unit to be butchered by their creations? Not exactly. Although the conditions encountered on this operation were extreme, it was an unexpected outcome that the team would be wiped out. We were only required to collect live data from the subjects. Oh. Another mutant! There we go, giant word time. Right. Really, what I should do... It's not Nemi, is it? It's the thingy. So what we'll do... We don't even... We don't even need that anyway. So we'll just magnum it. We've got plenty. But I'll, I'll take it anyway. Take it with us anyway. Right, freeze rounds. Pop that there. Um, we've got a load of grenade rounds there. Seems logical to take that. I think we're all set. We saved like a few minutes ago. So, yeah. It's only in the other room. I'll be about 30 seconds. Two seconds, guys. Get my hoodie on. Two seconds. It is freezing. Oh, why is the screen all black? Oh, is it done? Is it frozen? Oh dear. Have I just frozen the game? Is, it, is the audio still on? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. oh the game is frozen. Oh dear. Oh dear. Is it? Oh, I must have clicked off the thing. My bad. Sorry, guys. Sorry about that. Oh, jeez. That's better. Extra layer on. I need the warmth. Sorry, I must have accidentally kind of clicked off that. I was worried. I thought I shouldn't have, uh, shouldn't have thinged. Shouldn't have crashed. Cool. How many viewers have we got? I, I check on my phone, you see, because I don't like to um, mess with what's on my computer because I don't want to mess up the screen for you guys. Seven watching. Decent. Thanking you. Thanking you all. 21 likes. Thank you for your likes on the video as well. The thumbs up really do help. It just helps the video reach out some more people, hopefully. Sweet. Oh, it's all right. Cool. Just have to adjust and everything once I've got a hoodie on. Right. So we've got the giant worm boss. I think we're pretty set. So we go back with the key. Ah! Oh shit. Oh shit. Here we go. What's going on? Whoa! We've not long saved, it's fine. <gasps> oh. 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 You guys get a pump for this? What Y'all ready for this? Terrific! This was missing in the remake. They missed this out. Oh shit. Oh Jill. I was gonna say. Oh. We need to run. We need to run. Oh shit. He's cornered us. I couldn't see that. I thought he was lifted us in the air at first. What's going on? Where is it? There. Oh. I can't see any. Oh, I can't see anything. Side, where's the little coming from? There we go. And again, and again. This way, this way. Is that hitting it? I hope you've been hitting it, Jill. I know we've got all these, but don't take the piss now. <laughs> we got it. Yes. We made light work of that, guys. Beautiful. As Dano said, the Magnum is the best. You said that earlier in the stream, didn't you, mate? I was escaped by climbing up this fence. Yeah, look, well, can we do that? Instead of just thinking about it, Jill. <laughs> Never would have guessed. <laughs> you have to state the obvious. Mm. 
I can't stop a sip of anything, can I? No, you all just can't give me two minutes. We've got to kill these or else it'll just be irritating. Which way are we going? We come from that way. Right, I'll take it there's nothing behind us then. Go this way. Oh yeah, that's right, innit? We go up the ladder. Yeah, that's right. Get off me! to that. I think we've got to go to that red blip on the right. Apologies guys, you, you you should all know. I lose my bearings quite easily. Oh yeah. Yeah, look, we'll make a posh herb. This is a posh one. Y'all ready for this? There we go. Spando Valley herb. You are gone. Always believe in your soul. Oh. Look, guys. Right, so we need to be. Oh, we need to go around. Out of the way, Bruce Willis. Look at him in that white beater. There's only one person around here who can rock a white beater. That's me. I'm actually wearing a white beater underneath my prepared fairy shirt. Stop! Aim at the right one, Jill. Stop it. Stop it. Can't beat popping zombie heads with a magnet. I know, man. <laughs> you make me want to use it again. Last time we used it, I was showboating in the clock tower. Um, I was shooting the, the spiders that were climbing up on the walls right above me, and they pissed poison on me. They took a piss on me. <laughs> so that's what happens when I showboat. We are off the right way, aren't we? Cool. Cool beans. Cool beans, awesomeness, whatever you want to call it, we're making progress. We've been streaming nearly four hours, what is going on? <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't know whether to split this into two parts or just go for the full thing, but we've come pretty far, I, I think it's... No. Should we just do the full thing? <laughs> Are we given a choice here? Yeah, this is moving. Do we push it off the thing? Should we push him off? Yeah. We can't surrender and jump off. We've got to push him off. Yeah. Let's go, Jill. Let's go, Jill. Got to be done. I don't know what the best thing is. Uh... What? Good luck with the water puzzle coming up. Oh. Someone said that earlier in the stream and I couldn't remember what there was on about. Card curry. Um. Oh dear, is it worse than the clock tower puzzle? Tell me that. Is it worse? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Hmm. Well, whatever it is, I don't remember it whatsoever, and I hope I don't need assistance for it. Jill, listen very carefully. They're planning on launching a missile directly into the city as soon as day breaks. The explosion will be powerful enough to destroy everything. Are you sure about that? Positive. I heard it straight from a supervisor. They'll go this far to cover their tracks. Is that Bob Marley in the bottom right? Did you see that with that, like, that Rasta hat on? Looks like Bob... Oh, it's Bob Marley! <laughs> Looks like Michael Jackson and Bob Marley. What do you think? I can see a fro and a Rasta hat. What on earth? <laughs> what is going on? Manager's diary. April 25th. Today's my 30th birthday. I was transferred to this facility today. I'm very happy because the work environment is very different from life in the university. May the 14th. The disposal system has been completed. Using a special kind of gas, it can decompose the cells of the guinea pigs. We have to try this out before beginning practical usage of the system. Yet it is not 100% stable yet. May 20th. While I was checking the treatment room, the door shut and I was locked inside. I couldn't get out for one hour. I guess even if you have the key card, it's useless, useless when you are locked inside. June the 7th. The guinea pigs we have to dispose of are increasing. The system is not working smoothly. The laboratory staff doesn't listen to my opinions and get extremely frustrated. July 16th. We can't dispose of all the bodies and the quality of the liquid medicine is not good enough either. 
July 29th, thought the function of the system decreases, the number of the bodies we have to dispose doesn't. The infection level has increased and the antibodies we are using is no match for the new mutation of the virus. Some of the workers have been infected by the disease. I have continued to work but I always keep a gun with me. I must remember to save one bullet for me. I want to weep. I don't want to die here. I sweat that I'll lose my mind if I imagine how painful the death will be. They, they always write these notes when they have one bullet left at the light. I'm saving one for myself. <laughs> I'll see you later. We do. Facility key. Okay. Is there anything else on that? Engraved with an ID coated with some kind of special painting. Facility key. Alrighty. That'll go in our thing. Swing. Straight in our first aid basket. Straight in our basket. Oh god, it's, it's loaded with shit. It's in no order at all, this. <laughs> right, I'll keep the AR and I shall keep the. Yeah. Should I keep grenade launch? Yeah, that's fine. We've got plenty. I'll put this back. Save that for a special occasion. That should do, I think. That'll do. There's nothing else to use here. Um. I'm gonna save again just to be. Oh, I think for a bit. Just to be safe. I try not to save like every two minutes, but I don't know what's coming, and I'm not going for like any perfect run or anything. Um, I'm not a book for soup, I'm not a speedrunner or whatever. Nice and chill streams. <clears throat> um, I'll say it's chill with Nemi running riot, but. Yeah, Bok Basuki is an amazing uh, Canadian YouTuber. Resident Evil speedrunner. He's incredible. Alright, bye MJ and Bob Marley. See ya. Alrighty! Card key ready. Right, we still need that. Okay. Is that just blue? It's got like a tinge to it, hasn't it? I love that song, don't you? I'm blue, da 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 What an absolute classic. What? I pressed it. Is there another one? Oh, hang on. Can I press... Is that... Oh, no, we need to press that one. You're confusing me. Press that one. Can you just duck under it, Jill, for God's sake? You're so dramatic. Alrighty, let's press that again. Two seconds. This is one round the other side, I think, isn't there? Right, pass that. Alrighty. What's going on with it? Am I missing something? There's nowhere else to go, is there? Oh, jeez. What are you doing, Hop? Is there no switch? No, uh, no, you try what for. You just walk into the, the mist. Mmm, you're confusing me, girl. I look very derpy because I don't get what's going on. I stopped that one. Oh, right, I get you. My bad. Stupid hole. Right, so that's stopped that. Liam T, what's up, man? I've seen you quite a load of stuff before. How's it going? Thanks, man. I'm glad you love the channel. Appreciate it, man. Right, let's see if that's done anything. So that stopped it. Yes. Lovely. Oh, you work, mate. You want like a night shift? I've just been on night shifts. So I've just got a few off now. But I'm still in uh, night shift mode. So I'm still bounced off the walls. Um, yeah, thanks for tuning in, though. Even though you can't watch vlog. Thanks for um, yeah, watching, man. I appreciate it. Power's been supplied to safe system. Sweet. Okay, we need to find that door now. 
Gib84 Gaming. Good evening. Evening, mate. How's it going? Hope you're good. Uh, do you like night shifts, Liam? I, I prefer night shifts. I actually like them. Because um, there's less people than in the day. <laughs> These people are sound asleep. I do actually prefer it, you know. Right. There's nothing else to do in here. We, we've done the power to that room. Yeah. Decent. Yeah, thanks for stopping by, though. I appreciate it. I hope you guys are all well. People, the nocturnal uh, night shifters. I'm on a night shift on the streaming. <laughs> Done it for six years now, no customers. Jeez. Jeez, so you've been on, you've been on permanent nights for six years. That's mad. That's mad if you've, you've been on permanent nights. I might wait, wait till I've taken another hit. Because uh, I don't like to use these. Less people, yeah, absolutely, man. <laughs> no, I, I am a people person, really. I mean, I'm streaming, of course. <laughs> Use of facility, okay, all right. All right. Right, we'll go in here first. Um, yeah, it's just it's just more chill, that's all. There's less management around as well, because they're, they're asleep as well. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, no, there's just less people in general, you know. Um, it's just nice more chill um I'm, I'm very much uh nocturnal oh there we go look just take one of these that's fine cool beans i wish we found some more assault rifle ammo we've not come across any in the game we actually haven't we use one because we've got plenty you guys are so greedy, having a whole bullet to yourself. I wanted to like spread it across all the zombies. Holy shit. Let's let's put all them rounds into the grenade launch. I thought it was like a maximum 12 or something. Holy shit. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, I thought I'd still... Hang on. I thought I'd the AR. I don't know whether to take another green nerve actually. I might as well. Yeah, because I've passed up on quite a bit of health through the game, and then at one point, a little, little while ago, I was a bit like, oh shit. Is that fine? Oh, the elevator. Oh. I thought it'd be locked. Well, locked. I didn't think it'd be in operation. Let me let me just leave it a sec, because I've, um, I've unlocked that other door. I'm a bit overwhelmed at the minute, because there's a few places to go. Oh, it's locked my system. Alright. That's fine. Anywhere else we've not been. That's fine. We'll just nip in the elevator here. Oh, yeah. I, I absolutely love Resi 2. Favourite game of all time, the original. Uh, the reason I'm not playing it tonight, I would have kicked off of it tonight, but I've kind of... The last gameplay I did, it was like over six months ago, it's just a recording, and it's no way near as good quality as this, because this is like on PC, and uh, it's... Didn't have time to aim quick enough. Damn! Needed that, need that hair. Um, yeah, it's just that, like, I've already done a playthrough of it. I mean, I will be playing through it again, definitely. It's just, um, it was the last thing I did on the channel. I'd rather, obviously, just do something different. And Resi 3 just felt right. Um, I'm not amazing on um, the very first Resi 1. And I felt like I'd be kind of a bit too, I'd be thinking a bit too much, whereas I want to kind of interact with you guys. It's the first three I've done on the channel. The walk pollution control device has stopped functioning. It displays an error message. Okay. Mm. I'll leave it. We've got plenty. Honestly, we've got loads. Kind of scared just <laughs> thinking are we, are we a bit close to that. You know me, take risks. Um, so yeah, I will uh, jump back on Resi 2. So I might actually do it as my next stream. And like I said earlier, I know it seems like I'm doing it... Holy shit! Holy shit! Guys, I don't remember any of this because it's been so long since I completed the original. Shit! Um, yeah, it seems a bit backwards kind of um, playing Resi 3 tonight, then 2, then 1, but it's like, you know, a few streams in, then I'll be able to kind of play a game that I've got to think a bit more about. I don't do Resi 1 that smoothly. Um, it's been years since I've completed it. It's the ending bits. Security manual, okay. Just read this. 
Security on the plant. Since this plant is a facility under the disguise of a deserted factory, civilians will sometimes enter. If this should occur, do not hesitate to shoot them. If they choose to surrender, arrest them and transfer them to the laboratory. As new guinea pigs, you will be rewarded. That's so messed up, man. Maintenance of the device. This entire plant is controlled by an epidemic prevention system. When contamination is detected in the treatment room or decomposed specimen pool, the plant will automatically be locked down for isolation. In that case, you must follow the manual to unlock it. If the contamination is over the limit, the whole system will automatically lock down. Then you must remain in the plant and wait for subsequent orders. Those who leave the facility without permission will suffer extreme consequences. What is this? Water sample, alright? Alrighty. Um, yeah, Resi 2 mate, remake, yeah, it is amazing. Uh, they, they did a, an awesome job on the remake, I've got to say. It's better than the Resi 3 remake, and that, that's based on, like, the amount of stuff that they, uh, that they left out. It, it's such a shame. They left a, a lot out. Like I say, we were saying earlier, you know, like, the clock tower, um, like, the park bit and stuff. It, yeah, it's a shame. Um... I don't know when I need these things, so I'm just keeping them on me, do you know what I mean? I've, I've got a few first aid sprays, so we'll wait and take another hit before taking one, so I don't want to kind of just waste one, be a bit wasteful when I'm just on yellow caution. Um, oh yeah, I would actually say the Resident Evil remake is the benchmark for remakes. I would say so. Shadow of the Colossus remake, I've not, um, I've not actually played that. I think we could, we could do with Alright, what we'll do, we'll take some of these, we'll combine them. Right, we've got a lot of combining to do, guys, so just bear with. <laughs> we'll do that, we'll make a triple C, an absolute beastie triple C gunpowder, which will give us 48 magnum ammo, so we'll do that. We'll take that um, first aid as well, I reckon. I don't like to... It's hard because I don't like to be quite wasteful using things like first aid just on yellow caution. It's like, yeah, kind of be dicey with death a bit if I'm uh, being a bit too risky. Yeah, I prefer the Resi 1 remake of the original. Um, I do love the how cheesy the first one is. Plastic card, jeez, we we really need this card. It's for loads of stuff, isn't it? Contain safety in the lock will not be able to manual check this bit before. Okay. Oh no, is, is this the water puzzle yet? Oh no. Dano, you warned me about this. Um, yeah, the Resi 1 remake, it really is perfect. Um, I love that it's fixed camera angles and tank controls. That's what I, I wanted Resi 2 in that exact style. And I was, honestly, I was absolutely gutted that they didn't do it in that style. But it's still an amazing remake, but, or remaster. Uh, but in my opinion, it should have been in the style of the RE1. Take your water sample and piss off. I'm gonna have to do loads now, aren't I? It's gonna ask me so much. Oh, okay. I get it. I, I remember this a bit now. Okay. Alright. Unfortunately, I'll operate it. Oh dear. Yeah, Res 1 Remake on GameCube was brilliant, very impressive. Oh, yeah, amazing for the GameCube. The graphics for that. Absolutely unreal, wasn't it? So good. So we want B? Move to which? What are you on about left? Oh, no. Oh, this is awful, man. Yeah, you weren't kidding. I forgot about this. Right. We'll go back. I don't have to move C. Uh, no, that's not right, is it? Mm. That seems like it could pass. Let me try 
I actually quite like the concept of this. Yeah, obviously I've played this before. It's been it's been time. It's been a while. That ain't gonna cut it. Ain't gonna cut it. Right again. Okay. Let me try that. First time. Wow. Genuinely had no idea with that guys. Awesome. What a quite chess piece is it? Sweet. Right. Remind me to remember. We need to be in that corridor. Sweet. No, I quite like puzzles like that. That's decent. But yeah, it is a bit... It's a bit faffy, isn't it? That one earlier... Um, what was I doing earlier? GG. Thanks, man. GG, Gib. what puzzle I was doing earlier. The clock tower wasn't as bad as I thought because I, I pretty much guessed the combination right. I just I had to make minor adjustments but what was I doing earlier? I was doing a really oh I can't remember what I was doing. I had to get yeah two gauges in the middle and it yeah there was three levers one two three then there was a b and it was oh man <laughs> I thought we was going to be here all night genuinely you dab jammy dodger I actually am Anna. I would say I'm a custard cream because that's my favourite ever biscuit, but I'm definitely a jammy dodger tonight. That was unreal. Didn't expect that. Sweet. That is the result of our triple C. Triple C, what do you call it? Um, I'm buzzing with that. Um, keep this MO disc. They're in every. Oh, system disc. I thought it was an MO. They're always in every game, them MO discs. Right. Right, we just need to remember where we need to... Do I save it? I'll keep going a little bit longer. Sorry for sounding daft, what is the rebirth one? It's not daft at all, man. Honestly, I, I didn't get what it was, like, before I um, was watching these mods. What it is, this is Resident Evil 3 on PC, um, but it's just got, like, a slight mod to it. It's not heavily modded, it's just a graphical mod. Uh, so it's just called like rebirth, uh, basically. It's just to uh, enhance the graphics slightly. Um, there is an amazing one called the Seamless HD Project, but you need um, the GameCube version. Oh, I don't want to turn. I've got plenty in the box. Um, oh, I thought we could do something here. There must be something else. Um, yeah, this is a seamless HD project, but you actually need like the, the GameCube version of it. And I have it, a physical copy, but I need to... Oh, hell no! Did see that jump up just then? Hell no. Um, yeah, I kind of need that onto the PC in order to... Because um, the seamless HD project mod, that is absolutely really nice and crisp. Like, even better than this. Um, I've seen uh, people play it. But yeah, unfortunately, it's with a GameCube emulator that the mod is designed for, so I don't know if they're possibly going to try and bring it to PC, the PC version of the game, but yeah, so for now, this is the most polished up uh, version that I can actually uh, stream. But yeah, uh, I didn't know what it was till, uh, yeah, discover things on YouTube all the time when I was looking at mods. That was like a, a massive reason why I uh, wanted to we still need to go in there. Wasn't it? It was highlighting that room. Hmm. Let's just unlock that other room first, see if there's anything else, because, uh, yeah, I'm a bit confused. Oh, shit. Oh. We've got plenty of bullets for this. It's fine. Is there another? I just need to work out where to go. We've got a facility key. Got to go. Thanks for the hangout. Have a great stream. Cheers, Gib. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it, man. Nice to have a brief chat with you and hopefully see you on another stream. Absolutely. Um, I'm playing with a gamepad, uh, mate. Yeah, James Bevis. Playing with a gamepad. Keep. Absolutely not a keyboard. Because um, I'm no good um, with a keyboard. I'm thinking. Dead factor. Is, is that. Do I need to unlock that as well? I'm just confused. Let me just nip back into that room because it was telling me to go there. 
it was saying to go back there. And I was confused. I've done the water puzzle. I've done all the hard work. Oh, that's it, then. Sweet. Locked it now. Uh, yeah, so I, I'm uh, using my Xbox Series X gamepad. Um, I just find it really comfortable to use, really good. Uh, D-pad's decent. Uh, for the moving around, um, You're still yeah, wandering around. I'm no good at keyboard and mouse. Nikolai? <laughs> so, you want to get out of here alone? Is that your plan? I made certain none of the other supervisors survive. Since I'll be the only one who knows what really happened, I'll have more bargaining power when it comes to discussing my bonus. Then why kill me? I'm not on their payroll. What you eliminated for reasons of their own. The amount is modest. There is a reward to be claimed upon the confirmation of your death. That's great. Except I have no intention of contributing to your retirement fund. I don't have anything to say, so just shoot. I've got to say, I don't feel the greatest remorse. He has been a dick all game. <laughs> you have been a knob, Nikolai. Oh, how convenient. <laughs> Our turn. <laughs> that looks cool. That's a pretty cool close-up. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. We got that. Oh. What a boss is it? No. Warning. Proceeding with operation in Oh, God. Please evacuate. Is this like near the end of the game? What the fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, guys, I don't think we're going to have to start again. Well, you know, go from the last save. Fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, this is going to take us ages to get him. Shit. I've not got the map down. sat in the fucking box. <gasps> oh, okay. Right, if we do die, this might be enough. Right, we should have to... Oh, we'll have to play it super careful. Shit. I need to start doing that. Oh, shit. Oh, bollocks. Peter. I need to be doing the quick turn, I keep messing around. Oh guys, I'm shitting it! Oh, I can't believe it! Have I saved the Magnum ammo all game and then I've just not had a chance to fucking... That's it. Spit on him! Spit on him! Have I done it? That's, that's my problem, guys. I can get a bit greedy with my shots. I can't believe this. Oh shit. That needs to activate again. Shit. One more hit. One more hit. Nemi's had quite a few. Quite... I don't like blind firing. Right, we're gonna take that because we have a few hits. Come on, Jill. Really, he needs that acid stuff on him, doesn't he? She keeps aiming for them as well. I can't believe it. Well, this is his final form, though, is it? So we still, because oh, shit, we can still get the Maggie for Nemi. Shit, 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 shit. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, Jill. Mm, one more hit. <laughs> My famous quote. One more hit. It's fine. Right, relax. One more hit. One more hit. Right, take it out. Right, we'll roll and we'll activate these things. That's it. Spill him. Spill him. Spill him. Spill him. Spray with these. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Oh, guys, I can't believe it. We've 
recall that magnum I was sitting there. I've not touched it for the game until I've um, I took the piss and I got poisoned by the spiders. Right. Oh shit! Shit! shit. Okay. Okay. I hate time limits because I don't know where I'm going. Please say that, because that's just to get out of here. I don't know where to go. Memory's absolutely fucking with this. Right. Surely it's got to give us one more opportunity to save, because it obviously there's a final form of him in there. Oh, shit! Oh, shit. What can you kind of wait a minute? I know you confirmed, but just hang on a second. Hang on. Hang on. I can't believe I've been streaming for just over uh, four hours and we're already... Are we like at the end of the game? I thought I had like over an hour or so. I thought I was taking ages. Right, hang on, hang on. I just need to see where to go. That's all my bad. I'm going to aim for that save room. Because you need to go there. Stop. I keep pressing that wrong button every time. Every time. Anyway, you know you're at the end of the game when you see the naked zombies. The full Monty! You can leave your head on. Du, 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 du. What a movie. What a movie, by the way. Sorry for my constant check of the map, guys. I, I lose my bearings. I've had to reiterate that many times during the stream. You guys put up with a lot. GG for all those still here. GG. I love you all. Genuinely. GG. Right. I think we're at the end of the game. I think that's safe to say because we've seen the naked zombies. Oh, I meant to combine these. I might ditch that though. Um, right, what are we taking? What are we taking for the final boss? Right, this is an absolute shit show. There's so much in here. I'm confused because we still got the facility key. Do we still need that? Because the card key is like the ultimate thing, isn't it, really? But. Right, so what are we taking? We need... Shall I take the assault rifle or shall I do the... Okay. Let me just put in here what I'm taking for sure. Obviously, the look at how many. 160 Magnum bullets. Wow. Right, so we're taking them, right? We might take... I think I'll take the grenade launch, the grenade rounds and the freeze rounds because Nemi hates freeze rounds. It's worth taking them. Take them. Take the freeze rounds. So that's... They're for definite. Put freeze rounds in there. 24 grenade rounds. That's fine. So good. Me pretending like I've got it all together. All the gear. No idea. I can't take all of them. Because... I feel like I need to just shotgun, like, you know, for enemies, but I'll probably take that because I need the. Right, first aid. Hard key, facility key. I feel like I need all them, really. Sorry, guys, I'm very indecisive. I don't know whether to. Because we're, we're going to be able to discard them anyway, aren't we? Three will be enough, won't it? Three first aids. Yeah, what we'll do. We've hardly even used the shotgun in this game, so we shall take that, take all the shells. That's fine. First aid, card key. We're gonna um, end up using that anyway, aren't we? The card key and possibly the facility key. Sweet. Alright then. Look at that for a setup. Who is here to witness this setup? Let's have a look. Let me just have a look uh, how many people we've got. Cool, cool. Still at seven watching, I believe. I check it on my phone, guys. That's all because I don't, um, I don't like to mess with what's on my screen. So I don't want it to click off this or anything. My bad. Let me just heal us up. Is that all we got? We got a gold one. Yeah, we'll take our gold one. Spando belly herb. Gold. Is that up? There we go. Right, let's do a save. Because we've seen the naked zombies, so that means we're at the end of the game. 
Dano, I smashed him in. Would have been more satisfied than that. I know. I I'm using it. I promise. I promise. I probably, with the amount I've got, Dano, I probably would have done the could have done the whole game with the Magnum. I reckon we should do that, you know, because we've got more than enough. We start with a load, even if we use the um, assault rifle for a bit, and then go on to the Magnum. Right. So we need to be. Is that the right room? We've got a few red blips, so I'm not sure which one I'm meant to be heading to. I'm just glad I'm not on a time limit. Righto. Card key. We got it. Yeah, I should do that next time, actually, Dano. I can combine them, can I? Granada rounds. Sweet. Look at that for a setup. That's what you get for playing on light mode. I had to though. Plastic card comfort. Is it this one again? No? You sure? You absolutely sure? That does say plastic card and this is a card key. It's nothing to do with that, is it? No? Rightio. Looks like we're coming back there then. Yeah, I should definitely do that. Let's go around with the magnet. I'll definitely do some fun um, playthroughs, definitely. You know, we'll like uh, get some like mods on and stuff like that, cheats and whatever for infinite rocket launcher and that. Sorry, that must be so irritating. I don't mean to do that. But yeah, like just for now, I just wanted to do the. Uh... There we go, we can discard that. Oh, I've got some. Um, more naked zombies. Oh. Yeah, I want to call me off guard. Yeah, I just wanted to do like, uh, like you say, a, I'll take that while we're on our travels. You can never be too sure. Just wanted to do a, a normal run tonight. Um, that's what I want to do on each game. You know what I mean? Just play it normally, and then we can smash out the mods and the cheats and stuff. Jill! Jill, where are you? If you can hear this transmission, respond immediately. We can hear your sexy voice, Carlos. <laughs> I'm here. Seductive What's Carlos. up? I got us a ride. The chopper engines are running and ready to go. On my way. The city's about to become ground zero. Hurry up! And don't forget to take that device with you. What does it do? That device tracks the distance of the approaching missile. Make sure you bring it with you. Now listen to me. Don't give up. We're both gonna survive this. Just get over here! Alright, then he sounds like the F Mortal Kombat. Get over here! Got the radar suit. Alright, then. Um. Oh, don't, because that means there's like another meter just there. Just to make us all on edge. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Don't give me a time of it. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Don't give me a time of it. So I know where to go. Level D. All personnel evacuate immediately. Event level D. Oh, we're locked in. That facility key, that's bugging me. We must have had to go in somewhere. I, I think, I feel like I've maybe missed a room out, but the count can't have been a, a key item in there. We probably just missed out on some ammo or something. Alrighty, alright, we've, we've not long saved anyway. I preempted the, uh, the save, did I? Yeah, that key, we've got a stray key there. You're playing dead, aren't you? Naked zombie. Yeah, Dano, why do they have to be naked? I, I don't get it. I, I just don't get it. Why? I've just shot at a thingy zombie. You're just faking it. Look. And I go across that. I can't even move past his head. There we go. Boom, headshot. I don't know why I'm. I'm just taking it just because I can, because it makes us look harder. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> look at that. <laughs> That's what you get for depriving yourself at most of the game. Sorry, Dano, I'll get the Magnum out. Sorry, man. I shouldn't do that. It was Dano who just likes to live in the dream and I'm just, I'm just ruining everything. We got a photo. Because this is the time to just reminisce on a photo. <laughs> Classified photo found. Oh, here we go. This is a clue what we need to do. In my opinion, I feel like it's too early to use this Paracelsus sword. 
in actual fighting. However, in order to acquire the G-Virus that Umbrella has developed, it will be a great help to us. The power of the rail cannon is satisfactory, but please note that it's still having a few remaining problems. Technology Division, Colonel Franklin Hatton. Look at that scientist's eyes. He's just got white dots for eyes and a goatee. <laughs> You've got to love it. You've got to love them graphics. Did they die naked or lose their clothes as zombies? I don't know, man. They either stripped off, they was having a full Monty, and then happened to die, or they died with clothes on, but the G-Virus um, also eats your clothes. They're my theories. Who knows, Dano? We need to be asking Capcom this. They need to be tying up some loose ends and explaining themselves. Alrighty. There is not enough power to activate the system. So that guy, that is like an indirect time limit, that. So it's telling us the distance to... Oh, duh. Holster, can you count? Right. So what we've got to do, we've got to... Move these as best we can, but we got Nemi after us as well now. It's not going to be that simple. There we go, I told you. Can't just be simple, guys. Line. I can't believe we're like right at the end of the game. What on earth? I've done it in one sitting. I'm not speaking too soon. Please don't be too soon. I don't remember how difficult this is. I don't know. Right, stop being greedy, Hulk. That was me being greedy. It's just getting a shot in there just to show I'm intimidating and all that. You know. Right. Come on, Joe, hurry up. So we've got the second one. So what we'll do. We'll get a few shots in it, then we'll we'll have to like lead it um, across to one. Oh, shit. It's hovering right there, three. I'm not happy with that. Let's get it near you. You stay there, Rosette. You stay there. You dare spit your dare spit your poison over here. Can we do it? Come on. Let's go. So we have to go around the other side. Oh, it's got repair on it. I can't remember the process of this, guys. Right, so that's... I don't know if we can actually go and use it yet. No, it's not It's not prompted anything, so I think we need to actually damage it. We need to damage it down. Let's go. Right, you're too close. You're too close, Hulk. You're too close. Stop being greedy with your shots. Shit. Hurry up. Have I got to activate the thing? I have, I? Okay. You left me uneasy because I'm on a time limit. Oh shit! Can I connect power? What are you on about? <gasps> what are you on about? Oh, guys. <gasps> oh! It's 
Oh shit, okay. Oh, of course we're gonna exterior. We didn't come all this way. I have not been sat here since 7 p.m. So just run away. Let's go. Are we gonna head the we're gonna head the line, Jill? Hit us with a line, Jill. You want stars? I'll give you stars. Let's go! Let's have it! You know what I hated the most about the RE3 remake? Do you know what I hated the absolute most? She says that to him early on in the game as he's chasing her down an alley. That is not something you just throw into an action sequence. You don't throw that iconic line into there. It's for the end of the game, like now. You want the stars, I'll give you stars. Over here! Over here! <laughs> the voice actor having to do that. Like a boss. I wish, mate. I like to think like a boss. Feet in the box. I guess we're all set. All right then, we're out of here. That writing is just due to the rebirth oh, no. mod because it's a polished it's up here. mod. It's time to go. Iconic missile. Raccoon City's white. Peter Tree, we did it, team. We absolutely did. Oh, GG to everyone. Have a complete this game four and a half hours. That's it. I've had it. This time you <laughs> made me too far. Yeah, you and me both, Jill. You and me and the subscribers, viewers both, Jill. Absolutely. Oh hell yeah! It's not gonna be the, the best uh, ranking or anything, guys, but yeah. Oh wow! We did it! And now we have a rather unfortunate turn of events. It seems that the President and the Federal Council have passed judgment over the civilians of Raccoon City. The President and Federal Council have ruled that the Bacalus Terminate operation is the best course of action for this extreme situation and have since executed. Based on that fact, Raccoon City has been literally wiped off the map. Current reports have the death toll surpassing the 100,000 mark. Our hearts go out to those poor civilians of Raccoon City. We did it, guys. What a game. Jeez, first stream of the channel has absolutely flown by. Jeez. I didn't know whether I was going to be doing this in a couple of parts, really. What do we get? We'll find out after. I'll skip it shortly. Let's just see who's on. Let's going to see who's viewing and all that jazz. Yeah, we still got people watching at this time of the night. Thanks to everyone who's still here. <laughs> Absolutely awesome. Woo. How'd you find it? Well, I proper enjoyed it. Yeah, I always check on my phone, like, you know, where how many people are viewing and stuff like that. So I don't like to click off this and mess up what's on the screen and stuff, so. Oh, man. Yeah, this is my second favourite Resident Evil game. Uh, the bits that I don't like, it's just... I don't really like being chased, but I've got used to it in this. Um, I think it's actually quite realistic on this. Whereas, like, on the RE3 remake, I feel like they have overpowered Nemi a bit too much and made him too fast. And sometimes, even like playing on, you know, like the, the standard difficulty, like, you just don't have chance, like, sometimes. Um, yeah, so I, I really dislike that about the remake, but still. It's good. Um, oh, cheers, though, Dan. Yeah, thanks, Dano, for. Um, tuning in i appreciate it you, you've been here for ages you're still like you know tuned into loads of the stream i appreciate it man um yeah i hope you've enjoyed it um yeah but this will this will all be um viewable uh on youtube um once it's done processing because once i've come off live it needs to like all process and then go as an upload so um yeah it will do that it just takes some time i think like it takes like, a few hours or something uh, it'll sort out in standard definition, then it'll 
do it in HD as well. It takes a bit longer for that. But yeah, it'll be viewable at any time. Um, yeah, what a game, guys. That's flown by. I love Carlos's parts. He's such a great character. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, my plans now. Uh, earlier, I actually bought the new uh, Halloween Kills. I got it on Blu-ray. So uh, two versions of the movie. The original and extended with alternate ending. So that'll be cool. So yeah, I'm going to be... Uh, We'll be chilling out and watching that to celebrate. We did it, guys. That was not too bad, actually. Quite a few number of saves, but a few of them were quite cautious saves. Um, you know, so I just... Uh, I wasn't sure what was coming in some parts. So I, I couldn't remember, like, you know, like, towards the end of the game and stuff. But that's the quickest I've completed it. That's not too bad at all. Just over four hours. That's how long we've been streaming. So, here we are. We are back to the iconic intro. I could just literally play it over and over again. It's so good. So, yeah. It's time for me to go off. So, yeah. Um, prop hope you've enjoyed this, guys. Uh, and, like I say, if, you, if you've been watching live or if you're obviously going to be uh, tuning in um, once this is uploaded as a recording on YouTube, thank you so much. I appreciate you all. Honestly, thanks... Um, everyone for tuning in if you've tuned in at any point tuned in and out like honestly i appreciate you guys being here and uh yeah absolutely appreciate it all your comments uh, you know all the conversations that i've gone on tonight um it's been awesome just chilling and chatting with you guys actually live first live stream of the channel and yeah so thank you for all your comments your likes on the video um it's all really appreciated it just helps the video uh, you know do a bit better and hopefully reach out to more people more viewers and stuff so uh yeah um next um probably be resident evil 2 the original i'm kind of going backwards a bit in it because like i said i just want to kind of chill the first two streams and uh, chat to you guys and then by the time i've kind of reached resi 1 i can kind of uh concentrate a bit um, on that so um yeah yeah see you on the next one dano thanks so much um for tuning in uh, so yeah I've absolutely loved my first live stream, guys. Thank you to everyone who has tuned in. So I'm going to be signing off. So host the TV out. I'll see you in a bit, guys. You take care. I'll see you on the next stream.